And there we go. That was my uh, chopstick tutorial on how to use uh, your metal chopsticks, which you have five of instead of six, just to annoy people. Uh, and you use them to pick up your, uh, your, your nail trimmer, as well as your Raycon earbuds, uh, and put them back in, the, back in, their, in their containers. It's, it's how, we, how we get things settled here. That's how we, that's how we do things. I'm glad that... Uh, chopsticks? I'm glad that you guys uh, were able to be here for that. Um, next time for my chopstick tutorial, uh, we will we will uh, pick up uh, other things uh, such as uh, the, the things. I... <laughs> Why would you only have five to annoy people? I, I've mentioned that several times. <laughs> to annoy and to annoy and demean people, obviously. How's that going for you? It went rather well. You can just say to annoy me. It's fine. <laughs> Damn well. I, I actually have like a bag uh, full of uh, metal chopsticks and they're really cool, uh, but they burn. <laughs> oh. uh, that's why I don't really use them that often. They, they burn like hell because like the metal tips get hot whenever you use them in soup and it burns your lips when you go to slurp them. So, uh. I love chopsticks that can fucking kill me. That was a chopstick uh, solo that I just did. <laughs> uh, <laughs> All right, thanks. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> for my end, we just went in complete silence for like a solid five seconds. It wasn't complete silence. That was... You think I'm hearing that? It's, 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 yeah, totally it. it's totally audible. It's totally audible. It's a thousand percent audible. This is her it's a terrible tutorial. No, look, look. All right. So you start off. You have your two chopsticks. Well, first off, you have your five chopsticks, and then you just you take three of them. You take three of the chopsticks, and you take them away. And then you have two chopsticks, and then you you have them like this. You put them in your hands. You you secure the the chopstick. Uh, the bottom one needs to be up against the like this like underside of your thumb here. And the top one needs to be secured in between your two your two front fingers, and then you you just do that, and you're you're fine. Yeah, that's how you that's how you chopstick, or at least that's how I chopstick. There's probably like tons of other ways to do it, but this one's easy for me. <laughs> uh, to make a proper tutorial, just say draw the fucking owl. Uh, draw the fucking owl. There we go. Uh, <laughs> and then you can use this to pick up just about anything that isn't that isn't being locked down see look i almost picked up that but it, they wouldn't let me get out my fucking joy con so i couldn't even i'm gonna bring them out i'm just gonna show you i can pick up my joy cons because now I, that annoyed the fuck out of me freaking joy con holder locking my joy con in so i can't pick up my joy con making me look bad okay now i just can't, yeah now i just can't do it fucking now I just, i'm gonna try to get it around get around the joystick aha perfect <laughs> I'm glad it's all going well. Everything's great. I, I have proven beyond a shadow of a doubt that I am hey, the best. Guy. Did you know the Phantom Thieves? Yeah, yeah. doing exactly that thing that I did. Yep, the greatest. Absolute, absolute goaded. That's what I am. How's it, go how's it going, Linda? I see that you're busy. <laughs> yeah. The greatest, the greatest it's of all fine. time. Go you've goaded. Mm -hmm. uh, Lord's a bit. Thank you very much for the resub, my dude. Much appreciated, much appreciated. You guys might notice, uh, some of you at least, might notice that your, your orbs have changed besides your names. Uh, we have done a complete re redo of the, uh, the badges as well as the emotes uh, that, are, that are being shown uh, on, our, on, our, uh, on our stuff right now. They will probably be changed at some point in the future. Who's to say? Um, but also, uh, we have... Uh, different uh settings for a lot of our stuff hopefully with the new settings you won't see ads as often uh it will probably cost me twenty dollars uh, less less income per month but that's fine it's just twenty dollars as long as you guys give me twenty dollars right now we should be fine I'm waiting <laughs> pay waiting the difference right 
waiting for it right now. No one. All right, fine. Uh, <laughs> All right, we're turning it back on. <laughs> we're turning ads back on. There we go. No, I'm playing. Um, that was a joke. <laughs> that was a joke, everyone. What are you fucking speaking for me for? What the fuck do you know? I'm kidding. All right, so um, <laughs> <laughs> maybe maybe it's a cry for help. You never know. But uh, but uh, hopefully you guys won't have to worry about the uh, worry about the um, ads as often. I don't know though. I, I I honestly do not know how it's going to work. Um, there was the only setting I could do, which was literally just to turn ads off. So, uh, I don't think it actually turns ads off, which is really weird. I think it just m makes it to where you, the Twitch is going to decide still. So, it might not even be any change whatsoever. Um, we'll have to see. But, uh, basically, the orbs, uh, Red Mercy, uh, if you've been here any time from a year and a half to two years, you'll have the pink orb. Uh, which the pink orb used to be the, the last orb. The pink orb was the one where you got at the, um, at the one year mark. So that's why you still have the pink orb is because you've been here from one and a half years to two years. But yeah, no, not six out as, as a stream. Well, listen, I, I, I can't do shit anymore. All right. That's literally the last thing I could do was, was to press the button and I pressed it. And if it doesn't work, I'm turning it back on because <laughs> at least when it's on, I get money. <laughs> so we'll see. We'll see. And when it is, you get no money. So we have to kind of work with what we get here. <laughs> So this is either what we do uh, with this with this current setup, or I turn I turn I turn the button back on and everything changes. <laughs> uh, hype train, let's go, let's go. Oh, we hype. We had um, uh, Lindo about two minutes giving giving us uh, giving us a sub, and then we had Thaladin giving us a sub. Everybody's giving us a subs right now. Uh, the, the pretty pretty soon we'll have we'll have all we'll have all those subs. It'll be it'll be great. I guess I'll get away from my chopstick tutorial now. I'm gonna put those over there. Uh, and we'll we'll make our way over to the the main the main uh, show of everything right now, which is uh, the room here with my God. <laughs> you have a God. Uh, apparently, his name is Sangin Kirby. I don't know. <laughs> here he is. Apparently, that's my God. Um, <laughs> I mean, I secretly always knew. Yeah, that made sense. It's just how you know how people say like you, you'll you'll know you know like you, you like you'll know whenever certain things change your life like that's that's kind of that's kind of like where I'm at right now with with Sang and Kirby, uh, it's it's um, it's just it's just you know how how things are how it's things radiance. are gonna be from now on. Uh, I forgot to press the record button earlier, <laughs> so um, we're just not gonna record this session. That's gonna that's fine with me. It's less work. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> whatever you know whatever it's 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 doing it's doing your best uh we we got we look look at look at his little eyes look like a little blushies are great uh and then we got freaking uh uh i guess you're juicing uh i guess you're you're, you're juicing uh the boy over here is that was that what's happening yeah i'm trying to find the street where's his hair <laughs> I forget his hair. Where's Street and where's his hair? Quickly. Uh, Street, go, is, go, Street go. is over here in the garage. Uh, all right, right, right over in y'all. Oh, garage, lad. Eat. <laughs> oh, look at me. I have a fancy, a fancy, fancy, fancy freaking, freaking death garage. Ooh. <laughs> oh, yeah. He had that like spiky kind of like, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he's like if Alan and like yeah yeah I got it. Listen, I already told you guys he was supposed to sub he was supposed to sub like subject you guys to be like oh well this guy's supposed to be our Alan but haha he was actually bad boy and then you guys are like nah but we like him though so we're keeping him. <laughs> <laughs> he's ours now. I mean, at any point he could have told us to fuck off. Well, you know, you guys, you guys saved him and, and he hasn't he doesn't have any friends. <laughs> <laughs> no, he has plenty well, of friends. He doesn't remember any of them. <laughs> but yeah, he was supposed to subvert that that trope, but then he ended up becoming that trope that he was trying to subvert. Uh, it's, it's, it's very, it's very, uh, it's very like 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 funny in in the in the grand scheme of things uh, that, that that happened. Let's change the let's change the uh, the heckin the heckin card today. It was you were supposed to subvert the trope, not become it. Last time it was <laughs> last time it was uh, Ghost in the Attic. We'll do another one from the fan pack. Uh, we'll Ghost grab, in the Attic too. We'll grab uh, our boy. 
we'll grab our boy but not in not in the same way as we usually grab our boy we're gonna grab we're gonna grab the trap card of our boy mm -hmm. oh here we go <gasps> johnny steps there he Big is. titties. Overpowering release. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> We've if done you it. know what I mean. Look oh. at that overpowering release. <laughs> but yeah. Uh he's 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 pretty he's pretty fucking he's pretty fucking cool. I like I like that card. It's a very good card. Speaking of the fan pack, uh we didn't get to say it last week because we were having some issues with people being sick and it's a, you know it's, it's fine. But we did kind of mention it in the in the point five episode, which if you guys didn't see it is up on YouTube now. That's pretty fun. Uh, we had like a bit of a card opening, a bit of like just random dueling. It was a pretty fun little time. But uh, there were things I brought up during then that I want to bring up for everybody right now, which uh, kind of concerned the fan pack. I really enjoyed doing the fan pack. Uh, fan pack one was was very a lot easier than I thought it was going to be to make. Um, uh, not like to a point of like, oh, it was, it was freaking oh, it was a point of cut and paste. No, it wasn't that, but it was more like it wasn't any harder than doing a regular pack. So I do think that we can do it more often. We can do it uh, like some more times. So uh, currently we are on uh, this part of the uh, of the the uh, the Pharaoh fund. Once this Pharaoh fund is done, uh, I'm going to be giving everybody another ability. And then for the next Pharaoh Fund, we are going to have another fan pack. So that's going to be pretty fun. Um, and every time we do a fan pack, I'll do a, I'll do a stream of it to where we, got, we can like pick out some cards, another 40 or so. Uh, and even if all of them don't make it in, most of them will make it in, uh, just like last time. We went through the entirety of the fan pack uh, that came in uh, last time as well. Uh, if you guys didn't make it to the last episode, uh, very sorry. <laughs> But uh, but we 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 believe in you. Um, uh, we we got to see like all the different cards Joker, that were there. Look, we have uh, more money. To the duelist with an amazing eighteen hundred attack power, goaded Piper. Goaded. My Piper, what? you Piper, you're getting you're getting a you're getting a eighteen hundred attack power, goaded uh, freaking duel uh, some some some, some biddies. Sake, thank you. I've never used eighteen hundred. <laughs> <laughs> and then Holy Knight of Smite is giving another thousand. Says, never fear, for I am here. Uh, Holy Knight of Smite, where is that going to? Is that going to the uh, to the Pharaoh Fund? Is that going to any any person in particular? Where's that going, my dude? Thank you very much for the bits, both of you guys. I'm gonna go ahead and give Piper they um, uh, their uh, little installations. So one, two, three, four, five. Right. There you go. Thank you. But yeah, we will. We will I see owe you just, my life. We will see just how just how much that's gonna that's gonna go. I will also say. The reason I'm bringing up the the Pharaoh Fund as well is you guys. Um, uh, I I have told everybody that I am going to be moving very soon, so any sort of any sort of help with that is 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 very is very great. But I feel like having people. Okay, I feel like having people um, doing uh, uh, giving things back as well is is much better to do things. So that was a fake person giving 210, uh, <laughs> popping off, of course, right. popping oh, off the Pharaoh fuck. Fund. Uh, the Pharaoh Fund has I now didn't been think you were moving. the Pharaoh Fund has now been has now been topped off uh, with the with the three hundo. So everybody's going to be getting their their new abilities, which is going to be great. Uh, next episode, everybody's going to be getting. Uh, most likely, it'll be another empty like like person ability. That way, you guys can like trade them around later on. Uh, although you know we could go with like a more a more uh, uh, like regular ability. Maybe I'll even give you guys some of the abilities that the others. Uh, but I love this is ground. It's not even underground. It's just ground. Um, <laughs> maybe I'll give you guys like the abilities that the others would have had. That might be pretty fun as well. Uh, I don't know. Briska we'll learns medicine. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Uh, but yes. Uh, thank you very much, fake person. That was that was very 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 appreciated, my dude. Much appreciated. Thank appreciate you. It. Uh, and Holy Knight said they're gonna throw theirs into fund. So I'm gonna assume that I'm just gonna throw that as ten dollars, uh, starting off in the next fund. To do, do, uh, let's go ahead and go here. Uh, Hell and just yeah. like last time, uh, just like last time with everything, the uh, the next fund, just like for the first uh, uh, fan pack, will be 400. Uh, because the fan pack is a very much a, a bigger endeavor that I have to do. Uh, it's it's again, it's it's just as easy as putting in a regular pack, but I do think that that's that's a safe place to keep it so it doesn't happen all the time, even though I do. Now that now that I've decided we can do it more often, I don't want it to happen every week. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. So we are going to be we are going to be starting that off as well. Thank you guys both very much. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. Yeah. Uh, 
but uh yep next uh next time we will get some some new some new abilities uh whether they are abilities that uh used to have the other characters maybe i'll throw in like some of their faces on them or something or maybe it'll be um, abilities based on characters that these people liked so like maybe like one of them have like a little street ability or something or like maybe it'll just be again like the little blank abilities so that they can they can trade them around for for later use that might be pretty pretty fun as well we'll have to see we'll have to see uh doo -doo -doo -doo. Oh, yeah. next arc will be five darps dirt <laughs> <laughs> You did, we've done it. Dirt. <laughs> we've done it. Also, Pico, I don't know you're moving soon. Gonna, can, um, it's not. It's not anywhere in particular. I'm, I'm moving somewhere else in the city. Um, I'm not going to be able to see you again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's the point. <laughs> Anyway, thank you for watching Five Darbs Start. Come up next session to uh, watch Five Darbs uh, Larva. Um, we're done here, apparently. Our DM has quit. Yeah, pack up, pack up. Let, let's just go, I guess. What are we doing today? Yeah, I'm, I'm cool. I mean, I can just leave, so cool. I'll just go to sleep, bye. <laughs> Well, Emerald, it's just uh, you and go. me. And, and oh, there you are. Hello. I went and got, I went and got an orange soda. Uh, I wasn't oh. here. I was, yeah, I wasn't here for any for any weird things anybody said. So um, <laughs> don't don't tell don't tell me if I missed anything. So what's all that being said? <laughs> Uh, you guys, uh, we have, we have, uh, basically said everything we need to say for everything. Uh, I'm glad that the freaking stream boss is finally working again, by the way. Thank you very much. I have fa having fake person over there. Cause like last time people donated a big amount, the stream boss didn't freaking update and I felt super bad. I'm so, I'm so glad it's working again. Everything seems to be working again now, uh, ever since my restart, my, my restart on the, on the computer. So I'm very happy about that. Uh, with all that being said, do you guys want to, who wants to recap? the episode that we had like three or four weeks ago. <laughs> I already marked yeah, Lindo sure. before the spell was even done. <laughs> Alright, Lindo. Um, what happened what happened in the last time, you fucking pirate fuck? Thank you for for your sacrifice, Linda. Okay, so um Rika and Otto began the session with the tag deal against Linkin Park. Unfortunately, we forgot to make our Linkin Park jokes, so you know, oh, no. opportunity missed. In the end, it doesn't even matter. Get any um, jokes that you didn't get to do now. Yep. Um, there Castle they of are, Glass. Linkin Park. There you go. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, tag deal happened. It was a tense. Cards were lost. Cards were gained. Um, but yeah, overall, we won. High five to Riku and Otto. And then the group decided on what to do next, which they decided not to follow the gang members because, you know, dealing with more gang stuff isn't the greatest plan currently. Besides, they were like, everything's fine. Patch is just stressed. We might as well just take them at face value. Um, you know? And then... Yeah, we all split off to separate ways. Riku went with Runner and did some work over there. Preska decided to take the long way around, a way around to get to the base. And while she did that, she met Gear again, who was who found out that in that crawler area, she kind of you know turns off. So that was interesting. And while they were making their way back home, Preska decided to go to her old place investigate a little about it and reminisce and then the two of them had a moment on top of on the roof and gear talked about how much they you know liked the sky and then we panned up to the satellite sky which was just smug anyway with piper and otto um, they decided to head to otto's place and try to go to the top of the building to see if they could get a good lay of the land and possibly see if where the gang members went or anything that looks strange. 
And while on their way, Piper started talking about things that were going on. And um, she spoke about her past a little too much, which caused the moon to turn red and the Jason theme music to start playing and a horror movie began. So Piper also began to run away while Thrill Killer appeared and was constantly chasing them down in his brisk walking pace. And Riku appeared... Riku appeared, helped out a little, then he got knocked out. Kiwi appeared, helped out a little, then he got knocked out. Um, then Piper did the thing that anyone who would... Piper did the thing that anyone who is being chased by a serial killer should do and challenged him to a duel. And she won. <laughs> it was a great duel. You know, a lot of tension, a lot of danger. And then Thriller Killer was like, well, you won. We cool and gave her her deck back and healed Kiwi and Riku. And then after that huge misunderstanding, I say in air quotes, everyone decided to make their way back home. And then we saw Prisca on the way, explain the situation, and then Prisca, Piper, and Otto decided to go back to the base while Riku went back to his home. And yeah, that's what happened. Riku's like, I'm going to go fucking lay on my bed. <laughs> I want my I, real bed. <laughs> I would like my real bed. You guys can call me. You have my number. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much, Linda. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. We're going to throw you uh, a, couple of, a couple of installations since you don't have any. We're going to throw a couple, gonna throw a couple of matches. We're going we're gonna to just, just have, them, have them ready to go. It's like I'm going to go like bam, bam. And I'm going to throw them at you. Damn. Damn, violent. Uh, I guess you chose violence today. <laughs> I did. <laughs> cool. There will be much in the way of violence today. <laughs> you don't even fucking know, dude. I'm kidding. Alright, so... <laughs> Alright, I see how this is starting off. <laughs> uh, also, uh, Thanatos is right. I didn't say long may they reign, so I, I wrote it down. Long may fake, may fake person reign right here. It's, 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 been, it's been thrown in here. As well as this W. I'm not sure what the W... I think it's supposed to be for Will. Um, yeah, I guess it's you know, for it's, Will. It's, 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 it's there. Will. Um, there you go. So, <laughs> You're done. Uh, with all that being said, uh, we'll start off with the, with the majority of, of people. Uh, as um, uh, the four of you, uh, this this time including Kiwi, uh, would make your way um, uh, back to um, uh, back to the the main base of uh, whatever whatever you guys are. Um, you guys would uh, allow yourselves to to get in by by using the uh, oh so amazing door mechanism, uh, which is the the can that rattles. Um, upon allowing the rattly can to um, uh, let your people know that uh, that you're that you're uh, on your way to make your way in, uh, you guys do find that as soon as you guys come in, there is uh, quite a number of of changes that them uh, that has happened inside of this place. Uh, two of which are um, uh, in the very forefront of the area. You see, there are two du uh, two dual runners. Uh, that have seemingly uh, looked as if they are they are ready for for um, uh, for use. Uh, you find that uh, that Bindo and uh, and Mars are doing some um, uh, doing some uh, some heckin uh, like overlooks of everything here. You see that um, uh, you see that Deck is on one of them like revving up the engine, looking as if uh, she's having a grand old time. Um, and uh, you see that uh, that there is just a there is just a street laying down. Uh, on his back, over uh, over beside of what you guys can only assume is a even further wrecked security uh, <laughs> D wheel that has uh, looked. The last time you looked at it, it looked pretty stripped down. This looks extremely stripped down. <laughs> stripped down. <laughs> it was just like the frame of the bike at this point. <laughs> you see that not even the wheels are connected to it at this point. <laughs> I love my bike frame. Uh, you guys would also you guys would also see that uh, that Sano is no longer here. Uh, who knows where she went? Um, <laughs> she went to hide her new green hair from the uh, the shackles of the world. What do you mean? What do you mean new green? <laughs> it what was always mean? green. What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? Anyway, um... <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even notice. <laughs> But yeah, uh, you guys would come in. You guys would see that uh, that the 
the two the two dual runners uh, uh seem to be seem to be in working condition uh, from what you can tell uh as soon as kiwi comes in he looks around as if he's not seen this place because he's barely ever seen it he saw it that one time <laughs> <laughs> The one time he came over here, the street of bike and left. Yeah. Yeah, basically. Um, as he kind of look, looks around, you see him just sort of go over and like lean up against the truck because you know he's still, even though he he got himself healed up by by Thriller Killer with the uh, with the weird bandage heal that happened, <laughs> um, he's still looking as if he's very tired. <laughs> as you do when you get literally slashed over, you know. But uh, as you guys make your way in, uh, you got you see that uh, that Mars makes her way over uh, toward all of you. All right, everything should be settled. Uh, where the hell is Riku? Uh, he decided to uh, go to his own home for now. I guess uh, things got very uh, things happened. What'd you guys do? We what may have fallen down a hole. They oh. got chased oh, by a serial killer. <laughs> oh, uh, mm -hmm. that really, <laughs> that sure. really sucks. Um, I was, I was expecting you guys to say that you fucked with you know, my boss, but all right, that's a, a little bit better. I mean, Not today, technically, no. No, I mean, it kind of, I guess, because they did get into the tag duel before. You did what? But it wasn't with okay. Lincoln right. Park. They roughed up. Um runner a bit and we we didn't like that so me and riku tag dueled lincoln park and we won you say that they roughed up runner as you do you do notice <laughs> that she seems to look to you very sharply as you say that auto before stepping a little <laughs> bit closer to the group <sighs> what exactly happened again go into as much detail as you can think of she's like looking straight at you auto <laughs> <laughs> go oh, king go um, well after me, we went and bought some things. I bought a starter deck and a new, um, fuck, why am I already forgetting the name of this mechanic in the game? Regulator? Regulators. Regulators. <laughs> I got a new regulator. Uh, other people bought things as well. I don't think it's really what matters. Um, as we were leaving, Runner went to go talk to the boss, I think. But then Lincoln Park kind of shoved him. And I'm not, we weren't close enough to really hear what happened, and Runner really didn't tell us what happened, as far as I remember. <sighs> she looks over to, to Bendo as she just uh, brings her hand up, like, all right, we'll make our way out then. I gotta figure out mm. what's going on. I swear, I can't leave that place for a day. Hmm. She steps over as she lifts up her hand. Bindo's like, <laughs> <laughs> Bindo summoned. Also, um, Riku had a bit of a day. Um, we also saw Beatdown. Everybody went around. You're messing with the crawlers still? Sort of. We just happened upon them beating up the beating up. Um, Try not to happen Bob. upon them anymore. I know what Riku's like when it comes to things like this. I don't want the rest of you guys getting dragged into it. Mm. Happening upon the crawlers is not great. You guys have been able to be somewhat okay setting aside the kidnapping, looking to Piper and uh, Prisca. <laughs> Wave? They can do much worse. I only worse. got kidnapped once. Twice. <laughs> twice? Uh, mm -hmm. They can do much worse. Okay? Just if Riku's not a part of them anymore, none of you have any reason to mess with them, okay? If you're going to deal with anybody, yeah. deal with us. Don't get too close to any gang here in the satellite. As she looks to yeah, the three of you, given. as she looks to the three of you, see them just kind of like sighs. I would have thought that anybody who grew up here would know that. Whatever. <laughs> well, I'm not originally from the satellite. I was thrown here. Well, <sighs> maybe the rest of them can tell you more if you need it then. But seriously, <laughs> don't... Don't stick your neck out for anybody. Especially when the crawlers are involved. Especially when Beatdown is involved. Riku could even tell you why not to do that. 
Oh yeah, we we got to see back there about it. Lesson learned. But hey, I mean, apparently you outwitted a serial killer, so she shrugs. Maybe you're tougher than I thought. Mm. Oh, one more thing. She reaches into her uh, her overalls, and as she does, she brings out uh, a um, a card and throws and tosses it off toward uh, toward the three of you. Who's yeah, trying to catch it? I'm trying. I'm trying. Piper, you go. You go out to catch it. What? Uh, it seems, what? seems to get, It seems to hit you. <laughs> Not Piper. Prisca. Prisca. It seems to hit you in the uh, in the uh, in the uh, the, uh, the the work coat uh, as you catch it after it bumps off of your chest. Uh, you see what appears to be a speed world card. Car keys. I feigned. Oh, hell yeah. We did our best. You guys had all the parts that we needed, especially with that other junker you had. Don't worry about it. They should run pretty all well. Right. Thank you very much. Yeah, yeah, thank you. She puts her hand she puts her hand out on a wave as she does, she goes to leave. A min uh, just like a minute later, you guys hear the ringling of the can as you just hear, oh yeah. <laughs> gets off yeah, bike, mechanic. presses button, gets back on bike. <laughs> Is Street okay? Do you guys want to go check on him? Otto is going to check Should on we go street. see if he has died? <laughs> yes. Otto has gone to go check on Street. You know what? Go, King, go. It's going to be right behind. Otto, you make your way over to Street. As you do, you see that he's just laying there. Uh... <laughs> So... Is the sparking fucking wire nearby? The sparking wire? No. Not right okay, now. Okay, cool, cool. Are we gonna shock him? No, Otto would just, <laughs> you know, literally start pulling him away from the sparking wire out of fear. I they, think that's they, anyway. They didn't even uh, they didn't even hesitate. They didn't hesitate? They didn't even hesitate. They stripped the bike? They stripped it down entirely. They said they just needed a fuel pump. They 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 took everything. We we don't even know. They, 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 there was police here today. They don't even care. They took everything. Yeah. Uh, it seems they don't care at all. They just have their rules for fun. I'm supposed to be. I'm supposed to be like like in charge of this. Like what? Uh, <laughs> He just well, throws his arms up. up and then he just throws his arms up and then his arms like go to the sides like da. <laughs> he just hit the wood like underneath and like <laughs> You look over toward the bike auto again, like it just like there are pieces of metal missing. You look over toward these bikes, you see that some of their like frames have been like um, uh like hastily like like welded together with like other pieces of metal. You see that like the wheels are gone, the like the pedals are gone, a lot of the circuitry in the top is gone. It is literally a bare bones frame with even more of a, of even that taken away from it. You can see that they took the part that says security, and you can see it over there. It's kind of framed on the other one, but if they remove <laughs> the security part, it just says, like, it. Ave <laughs> Bikeria! As you just see, like, again, just to, like, kind of fit the image, you just see that the bike, the, the frame is being held up by two cinder blocks. <laughs> 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 He's just laying there. <laughs> what do we tell your friend? I don't know. That was his bike. <laughs> it sure was his bike. <laughs> it was the ruined one, right? Yep. It was already... Yeah, the one that got fucked. Uh, okay, okay, I got this. We tell him that... Those parts that were taken were unfixable and... <clears throat> No, the. Where and wasn't he supposed to like show up to a report? I have no idea if he needs the bike or not. Hmm. I we guess could... we'll. I guess we'll know eventually. I mean, he looks over. I got it. He knew Strict, it was basically told, tarp? right? Hmm? Points over toward the the tarp that's on the um uh the 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 like <laughs> car over here. The car over here. <laughs> Grabs the tarp, puts it over the bike. <laughs> Say that it's in the middle of repairs. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's so repair that it's just a bunch. It's literally just a metal frame. The wheels are just for show at this point. What wheels? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the cinder blocks. I don't know what to do here. I just, uh, I, I was no, thinking it's, it's... the most awkward thing here would be me asking if you sweat it in a bottle for me. Oh yeah, I did that. <laughs> All right, see you guys in a couple hours. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, cool. All well, right, later. All right, Preston. have this is fun. Like, right, uh, yeah. Hold on. I'll, I'll, and, uh, <laughs> he goes to get up. <laughs> As he does, you see him You see him go like uh, upstairs to his quote-unquote room uh, before coming Jesus back down. Christ. You see that uh, there does appear to be like one of your vials you had left him. Uh, as you see, there is, a, there is a, a somewhat clear liquid inside. Not a lot. Um, uh, but you do see there is there is a bit in there. He's like, I didn't know how to get it very well, so I just kind of worked out. I don't know even if this is. I'm sorry. <laughs> don't hey, even. Well, from the sounds of it, those people that dismantle the bike to help you in the process. Here. <laughs> <laughs> I still, I still can't believe that you agreed to try to feed a dragon's endless hunger. I was panicked, okay? And when you're panicked, that's a perfect business opportunity. Right. I wasn't always like this. <laughs> uh, no, I'm not judging or anything. I just, it's not, I'm it's... not able to get you. I was Much. just a girl that like <laughs> made a volcano go boom with baking soda, and now look at this. And now you're what collecting sweat. Doing? Yeah, life, life really does take us in mysterious ways, doesn't it? You're collecting okay. sweat for a necro dragon thing. I, I was just, I was just trying to figure out how best I could get this to you. I mean, uh, whenever I was and thinking, I thinking about it, uh, <laughs> I don't know how science works, so I was just. He like motions to the amount that he uh, that's in there. I'm I'm decently sure I sweated like a lot more than this. And of course, the volcano wasn't good enough for my mom. See, oh, now that I'm oh, thinking about oh, oh, it, oh. I wanted to use. I think you could have just oh. got him to spit in a bottle at that point. If it's, if any liquid counts. Oh yeah, like... did you do the spit bottle too? <laughs> Jeez. I didn't. <laughs> You didn't tell him to. Let's hope this is the only thing we need right now. Okay. <laughs> Prisca, at the very least, I it sounds like I have to do a lot of trials on this to figure out what to do and what not to do. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sorry, yeah. Street. No, <laughs> it's it's fine. I honestly, I just don't know what I'm gonna do with the rest of that. He like motions to the tarp. I think, honestly, the best thing would be just to scrap it up and move it somewhere else, you know? Oh, we didn't, we didn't, we didn't have this. We, we, it's, it's gone. It's destroyed. You took... Because, like, he took the thing that tracks it with him, right? So, like, no one will even know. I mean, if you're desperate, you could just unveil the tarp going, Oh, no, what happened? <laughs> You see, as soon as he mentions like cutting it up or scrapping it, you just see you just see uh, Kiwi start walking over to you guys. <laughs> oh boy, here we go! Uh, not literally, not literally. <laughs> you see, his hand was going to the sword, then it went away from it and just and just leans up against the truck the truck again. <laughs> uh, that is a good. I don't know. It probably would be easier to do it literally. It would probably look less like a bike frame. Yeah, I mean, do we have anywhere to take it to dump it? somewhere i mean i guess there are a couple of options uh literally anywhere considering if we cut it up in park i know a place um, we can get rid of scrap <laughs> you're right the open <laughs> sea <laughs> no that's littering piper i'm talking about scrap <laughs> <laughs> can we even lower that down oh, yeah, yeah the... if, i we think could, at that point we could probably take it to scrap -a. Hmm. He could probably make some... see. He could probably make a nice dragon out of it. I'm... How will we get him? I'm just, just gonna think it about it. It's like, I mean, I guess we could toss it down a hole and just go from I mean, there. After we cut it up, we'll just carry it in a bag. 
Yeah, one bag. This looks like the job for the metal sheet. She goes over to the truck. <laughs> you guys just hear the start hearing the metal. As she, like she's maybe. trying to like push the push the truck apart. <laughs> um, Jack, maybe not yet. Oh, okay. Well, well, well. Yeah. I like Chris. Like, let's just go and get in a bag. What's a hundred kilograms of metal? <laughs> All of us would carry a separate bag. Chris is like, might be the lightest. <laughs> <laughs> Look at me in the eye and tell me that we can do that. <laughs> I'm not going to look you in the eye. I'm looking at my experiments right now. Yeah, have fun <laughs> looking at your spit, Prisca. Uh, I, I made sure that nobody touched her stuff over there, though, so it should be fine. You look over toward the underside of the, uh, uh, of the, uh, the uh, thing over here, or you see that there's like a lot of space cleared out for your, for your uh, vials and beakers and things. All right. Right over Nya. She slams her hands down, which doesn't make much of a vibration because of how weak she is. You slam down onto the tarp. <laughs> it collapses. And she's going to silently get to work. All right. We move Chris is... over, toward, uh, over toward the area there. Uh, again, you know that you have things set up in the room beyond this as well, if you wanted to do anything here. This is just sort of like a, a quick area. Uh, you have like the the little like this is like a little like a little like quick station, but you have like a more thorough like like lab stuff where you took all your other stuff a little bit in, uh, deeper inside this place. Um, as that happens, you're gonna go and start working on some some stuff with the street juice. Yeah. <laughs> what about the rest of you? What are you guys gonna be doing? That's a very good fucking question. I'm just street staring just goes at this over fucking... and leans up against the the tarp and just like sits down. <laughs> You guys hear more of rooming happening from over with Deck. <laughs> She's having a good one, all right? You see that she eventually uh, goes over and presses the button and then goes back, and then you guys just hear the thing revving up. <laughs> uh, oh. Do you even have a speed deck? We. <laughs> all right, have fun, I guess. <laughs> Try not to crash. It's... <sighs> I <laughs> should we just let her do that? At this point, I don't think anybody could stop her. I could stop her <laughs> without destroying the bike. Oh God, I taste tested. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> why did you lick? I'm the imagining. Sweat? I'm imagining the fucking the fucking homestuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh my fucking god. <laughs> But yes, as as she goes out and you say you and then you say without without ruining the bike, he just his hand goes away from the sword again. <laughs> I just hope she doesn't get arrested. That is precisely uh, the reason why I'm worried right now. I mean, not for not particularly the arrested part, more the, uh, uh, you know, the whole bike runners in the street trying to murder people part. I feel like she could really <laughs> handle her own, at least. I'm not sure how as she we is all, duel, but... As we all remember the point five episode last week where I used her deck to such great use. <laughs> but that's meta anyway. Dude, I need I to know. just I need to just have a thing where like one of the again, I just need to make a Pharaoh fun one day where I just completely redo like redo all the cards in her deck or like in some other characters decks and just like fucking deck two. go crazy. <laughs> the the NPC upgrade fund. Yes. <laughs> uh oh yeah. You guys see deck make their way, make their way out. The rest of them start like spreading around uh going to different places to check on things. Uh you see that calf uh goes over toward uh toward Prisca to be um, uh, to be of any aid. That he possibly can be, <laughs> but uh, as everybody spreads out and like kind of like moves things around, uh, Otto, Otto, and Piper, yeah. Uh, uh, who's trying to help? Uh, you see, Calf go over and like, yeah, like try to help. Here. Yeah, Calf. Calf's the one you guys like. <laughs> Please yeah. don't make him taste test. <laughs> Please. As as Piper 
just uh, not Piper. <laughs> no, I did. <laughs> what I do now? <laughs> <laughs> You tried to kill the dolphins by dumping it in the ocean. Oh fuck! <laughs> he called you I'm out. <laughs> I I expect I expect a fumble to say fuck the dolphins, but the silence is scary. Dude, we saw how effective silence was earlier. Yeah, dude, <laughs> silence uh, is powerful. Brisket does kind of go. It's okay. I got this. I got this. I don't want help. I don't want you to be a part of this. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you don't need me Unless... to carry anything for you or uh, get anything for you from your other room? No, right, no, no. Just right now, it's me. It's these. It's me time. Uh, why not help? Uh... <laughs> Yeah. Why not yeah. help them with the bike somehow? I, I just uh, the bikes are are done. I, I I don't have anything else really. I mean, I don't have to be here. I can go uh, do something else. I, I guess. Did did they slice up the bike? I don't think they're doing anything about it tonight. Oh. Uh, um. I, I, I I'm really making I'm making things you. awkward. I'll leave. <laughs> it's not awkward. No, it's. Uh, <laughs> I just. <laughs> uh, yeah. like, do, you have back do you have any demons? Do you have any demons to help taste test? Uh, probably not. <laughs> Sorry, I just this is my thing. No, no, I, I, I get that. I'll, I'll, I'll go. I'll go do something else. I guess. I'll, I'm sorry. I'll, I'll leave. <laughs> I'm not mad at you. No, I, I, I get you. I, I understand. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I, I appreciate the thought. <laughs> but yes, what, what are what are Piper and Otto going to be doing? Piper's just staring at the door after she left. Like, oh god, oh god, oh fuck. There's another bike right there, Piper. <laughs> that is true. I don't have a very weird question. Do you do you happen to have a speed world card in your in your hand or anything? Uh, speed world. I don't yeah. have one of those, but I do have a couple of speed uh, trap and magic cards. No time to build a deck. Thank you, Ada. Uh, Prisca, do you happen to have a speed world card anywhere? Gives Piper the one I was just given. Oh, sick. Thank you. Uh, this is just a stupid idea. I wanted to go to sleep tonight. This sucks. This sucks. I know how you feel. I want to sleep tonight, too, but it's an all-nighter, baby. Do you even know how to drive one of those? No. I will move the bike key card over to uh, over to you, uh, Piper. There you go. You have you oh, now have the, the bike key card. Auto, auto. If we don't see each other tonight, we'll see each other in hell. It's fine. Um, we'll meet what, each other again one day. What's the AI's name again? To do you guys know know the AI currently as Gear. Hey, Gear. You there? One second. Let me see if I can find the setting again. Is this it? No. Is this it? Kinda, but was she, did, did they have a robot -y voice? Yeah. Okay, then we'll go with this. One second. <clears throat> yes, Priska, do you need help? I know that you just pushed off the person that tried to help you last time. <laughs> oh, uh, I was just wondering if you could help uh, Piper learn to drive a bike. Uh, I can't help learn to drive one, but I could um, put my consciousness there for the time being. I was a dual runner AI after all. There you go, Piper. What? I'll Wait, make Piper. My, I'll make my way over there. <laughs> Prisca, Piper you see <laughs> Prisca, you see your your dual disc that you probably have like on the on the counter or something like give off a a tiny spark and then you just uh you just uh, see uh, you see Piper over with you. As you are trying to to scooch everything going forward and everything, you just see like a light up happen on like the the front of the the dual runner. There we go. I am now online. Oh oh uh, hi gear. Oh, sorry, I I guess I didn't ask you if you needed any help. Would you like me to leave? Uh, that's fine. You can be here. I everything happens so much gear. You know that. Uh, uh 
I'm I'm sorry we haven't talked that much. Uh, are, you, are you going through problems? Do you need help? No, I. The help I need now is driving this bike. Of course, I will make sure that the safety protocols are engaged. Thank you, Piper. When you get back, because I can't stop you, because you're already on the bike. <laughs> I do want to ask about what happened today. It, it, it drives faster. <laughs> I was, oh. It wasn't going to be entire details. I'm already oh, gone. Hold okay, on, goodbye. I'm gonna hold on. I'm gonna do something. Is I keep it, it keeps annoying me on on the dual runners that I can't like have them uh, like faced in a direction I want them to be. So I'm gonna actually like like do something really quick. Give, give me a second. <laughs> give me give me a moment. Give me. A, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna try to find the final thing. <laughs> Where do I have the dual runners at? Where are those fucking crazy bikes? <laughs> do, 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 they're not in there. Do, 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 they're not in there. Oh. Sorry, this is entirely for me now. <laughs> I'm so very sorry. <laughs> It's fine. Don't I just want to. I just want to. just want to angle the bike in a in a in a way that it'll it'll look like it's going in one direction from both sides. <laughs> oh, good. Da, 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 da. Retransform. Flip. <laughs> da, 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 da. Actually, yeah, I'm gonna have to. I want to flip the entire like thing though. I don't want to just flip that area. I want to flip the entire thing. There we go. I need some relaxing music. Gear, play women horror streaming. <laughs> <laughs> relaxing music. <laughs> well, well, well. Yeah, yeah. It's the inseminoid one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck, I keep on. I keep on doing. I had to like upgrade my Photoshop as well. Yeah, how Whenever does it feel this. to be upgraded? It's 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 all right, but like I don't know what any of the buttons do anymore because <laughs> they they changed how the buttons look. There we go. I fe I figured out how to make a new layer. I did it. I'm amazing. <laughs> I'm so good at I'm so good at this. <laughs> You're a champion. And I flip. Perfect. Perfect. Then I delete this layer. Perfect. We'll throw it on the desktop, because fuck it. Perfect. <laughs> okay. I love it when you're having a good time. All right, now watch this shit. Custom back image. There's going to be a back image on this B. Oh, fuck. It's going to be mm -hmm. great. We're getting a dual runner with two sides. <laughs> Now we could have it be a. Now we could have it two modes. <laughs> no, Left now it right. can both be shading on the because they can both be on the same area. Because why right now, if you turn around, one faces the other way. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's that's what that's what I'm trying to fix. I know I'm explaining. I don't like it. <laughs> I'm sorry. You could. I could have just done that for you. I could have done it too. I mean, you're oh, doing it, so doing it I right now. Need... Okay. I did it. <laughs> I so think. like I'm doing think, anything Yeah, right you did now. it. There it is. <laughs> yeah, it's, 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 it's facing the same direction. <laughs> Huzzah. Like, yes. Like I think it also, like, changed the, I think it also changed the other one, the, the one that, uh, the one that is being, being the ridded on over Nya. Yes, it also changed that one. Cool. Yes. Awesome. Heck yeah. Hoggers. I didn't know you could do this. This is awesome. I've done it. It's been done. <laughs> you want me to preemptively do it for all the future ones? Why? Just in case. How dare you think that I can't do this again? Okay, I won't ever do this again for you. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I'm Damn, all right, gang. <laughs> no, no, he doesn't need my help. It's, I'm it's all sorry. good. You got this. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, uh, uh, you want to make your way, you want to make your way out from here. Yep. Uh, first thing you notice 
whenever you make your way out onto the area over here is that uh, whenever whenever Deck left, they didn't press the button again to to raise the the bridge. <laughs> I love I love society and all the work that I gotta fucking do in this house. Do you wanna do you wanna call back to you to your friends? Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and say that. Auto call. Hey, I, hi, Otto. Hello. I'll be here to raise it up. <laughs> Thanks, Otto. Well, Otto, the button's way back here, though. Oh, right. Duh. Thank you, Otto, for being I will here do the and button. then there. <laughs> the button will be done. It's <laughs> <laughs> about... Alright. So, so, so as Piper... I'll literally let you do this so you know. So as Piper <laughs> is, is going out into the town, uh, Otto, what are you doing? <laughs> Well, <laughs> button pressed again. I guess Otto is going to work on his fire decks so that in character they can be done and ready to be used. You make your way up onto in, into Street's place because it's the most comfy place in this place. <laughs> it's the most comfiest place. And spreads you start, out the cards. You start the fucking. You, you spread them out on the on the pool table, and you're like, all right. It's time to fucking go. You get some, like, string, and you start, like, connecting things for, like, combos and shit. <laughs> mm -hmm. I have a lot of burn cards in this new deck. I can take those and put them with these cards, and they'll do even more damage. Burn decks might be nerfed, but this will still do a lot of damage in the end. You're, like, using little, pu little like, it. push pins to, like, connect the strings and... <laughs> yes. yes, this is my magnum opus. <laughs> With All the right. twin fire decks. We know what you it's three just like are doing. A whiteboard. We know what you three are doing. We'll come to each of you and then decide what what happens uh, whenever whenever you guys do your things. Uh, 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 we're going we're gonna go to we're gonna go to our boy Riku really quick before beforehand. See what he's gonna do with the rest of his night. Do, 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 do. Uh, I'm gonna move you from uh, from the the world map over to the uh, the apartment <coughs> map. Mm hmm. Do, 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 do. There you are. You have made it back to the apartment. You are feeling shitty as all as all anything. Um, as you as you move off uh, up toward up toward your room, uh, you once again look down the hallway, and as you do, uh, you notice that just about all the doors are open again. For fuck's sake! <laughs> <laughs> uh. Uh, mm. <laughs> Three hour montage I'll... of uh, of Riku groaning. I guess I'll uh, he'll close all he'll peek inside and then close the doors. You make your way to to these two rooms. You like peek in. You don't see anybody in the immediate vicinity, so you close the doors. Uh, do the same thing for for the next room. You look inside this one's like, oh, that's a pretty fucking nice room, actually. Um, but then yeah, you, very nice. but then you, you close it and you close uh, and you close uh, Mars's door. Uh, you make your way <laughs> to to uh, to Piper's to Piper's room and just kind of like look. It's still in. garbage. And you're like, hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. <clears throat> you notice as you get there, uh, a very large rat seems to come out from the room, like look to you. It's like the it's like the side it like comes up to your shin, and then it seems to disappear into the junk. So that's what pa Prisca always talks about. <laughs> Closes door. <laughs> uh, you look over toward toward the room behind you, and it's like, oh, it's another pretty nice room. Um, you make your way over toward your room, and you notice that your room is is open as well. Uh, but you notice the room across from yours is not. He goes to the other room and just knocks on the door. <laughs> you knock on the door. No one seems to answer. Knock again. No one seems to immediately answer you. 
see if the door just opens if I just like twist or is it, if it's locked. You go to twist the door uh, to see if it'll open. Before you do that, why don't you roll me? Uh, why don't you roll me one of them? One of them cheeky, cheeky little little uh, instinct rolls. I got you. Uh, I'll put. You know what? I'll just go. I'll roll bro. Let's just go bro. Da, da, da. Mm-hmm. Thirteen. Two. Such a lucky number. Such a such a big such a big luck. Such a monument. I love uh, numbers. Uh, it's fourteen with this card. And uh, it's true. It's fourteen with uh with your with your full card. Da-da-da-da. Yeah. You go to the um, you go to the, the to the door and you go to open it. Uh, you see the door does seem to open rather 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 finely, like rather rather easily. Looking inside, it seems to be a ra- you seem to be a, a, in a rather nice room. Uh, it seems seems uh it seems rather well taken care of. It isn't isn't extremely flashy like the room off to the off to the side of it. But mm. uh yeah, the the room opens right up. There doesn't seem to be anybody inside here. Hmm. Just kind of look around further in, I guess. You start making your way further in. As you do, uh, roll me one more instinct, please. Gotcha. See if you get it this time. (laughs) I won't. We'll see. You you might. Uh, Nope. Let's go. Hey, that's an 18. 18. I also have two more fleetings, but I think I'm going to save those for a moment because I'm not sure what's about to happen. Um, gotcha. <laughs> uh, how much HP do you have right now again? Nothing. That's great. Um, <laughs> well, <laughs> as you step inside and, um, uh, and you step a little bit further into, into this place, you do notice uh, just out of the corner of your eye, as soon as you pass by that area, you look off ap- just like almost absentmindedly into the kitchen area. But before you turn all the way to look there, you notice something out of the cor- out of just the corner of your eye over on the other side, as you see. Doo, doo, doo. If I can find them, I'm sure that I can. Da, 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 da. You see what looks like a tied up ninja. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to get knocked out real soon. I. As soon as you turn to the ninja, you look over toward the door as you notice the door has been closed. Okay, whoever's doing this, just get over with. <laughs> just, I'm tired. That I can't do this all day. We could try and talk about this. Oh, you can just knock me out. Well, if you want it so bad. Riku? Yeah. I need one. Are you are you just going to let them knock you out? <laughs> I, I, it's either we can talk about this or you can knock me out. I'm trying, you know. Are you just talk. done? Are you just, are you, I just want to know uh, if you're going to dodge. <laughs> No, he is not gonna even touch. <laughs> yeah, he's like, I've been through so much today. I just yep. <laughs> You're just like fucking fuck it. You hear that from just behind you as you do bump, 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 bump. <laughs> You feel the you feel the feeling of something hard uh slam just into um, uh, into the um, uh the um, uh the the crick of your neck and as you do you collapse downward in your fuzzy vision, you look up as you see what appears to be a woman standing over you. <laughs> and uh, you look up, you recognize the card, uh, the, the face of the person and the outfit of the person. And right as you like see them stepping over with a cane in hand, you seem to pass out. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't try to dodge! <laughs> Uh, it's what he's done today. <laughs> yeah, he's just like, he's I'm done. just accepting it. I'm just right? fucking, I, I don't care anymore. It's just whatever. <laughs> just fucking kill me. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, I'll fight back tomorrow, but today, just go <laughs> I'll, ahead. I'll go fight kill back me. tomorrow. It's fine. It's like, all right, uh, Linda, I need you to make a new character. Uh, I'm like, fine. <laughs> <laughs> 
All right, Lindo, a uh, new character time. Let's go. Uh, okay, so that happened. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um... <laughs> do, do, do. Uh, Today, we will go, we will he go, just uh, gets hit with a car and dies. <laughs> we will go to, to everyone in order to determine uh, different things going down. Um, first off, uh, uh, just going to Otto here. Otto, you're using the time to fix up your, your decks. Yeah, so we're gonna uh, say this is the time when you make your your two extra decks. Mm-hmm. Heck yeah, heck yeah, cool, cool. And he throws in uh Cyber Valley into his main deck. I think. I think that's a a good idea. Hey, heck yeah. <laughs> Do you change up your your side deck at all? Uh, yeah, I changed it up a bit too. Okay. Heck yeah, heck yeah, you did good. Look at you. Uh, because that doesn't really require any role play or any like roles or anything. I'm gonna uh, we're gonna say going over to Prisca. Prisca, you are trying to you are trying to concoct uh, the uh, the Oso uh, essence de, uh, essence de uh, de street. Yeah, it's streety juice. Your streety juice. Uh, I would like you as you are as you are concocting this material. You don't have a ton of it to of it to kind of work with. Also, I'm loving the new drip. Uh, you you don't have a ton uh to work <laughs> with at the drip. moment. Um, so as you are, uh, looking through and having to deal with the, the small amount you have, uh, I would like a couple of rolls from you. Uh, yeah. One is going to be your experience to see if you could ever figure out how to get more, uh, from this without much more effort. <laughs> I'm going to use my last inspiration for this. <clears throat> Heck yeah. That's going to be 14, 15 altogether. Uh, you know that you know that uh, Street probably didn't think about it, but uh, you do feel like if you had his uh, you, if you had his workout clothes or anything like that, uh, that you would probably be able to get a ton more just by diluting the clothes by like sticking them in water and then like you know boiling, getting you know the essence of Street uh, down into a fine to essence. a fine uh, uh, into a fine a like fine thing. You, could, you could probably get uh, around like two to three full vials from a good workout. You would know you would think from that. Um, which is a lot better than here, which you have like a fourth of a vial, maybe like half. Ah, oh, God, I have to ask for a shirt. Oh, God. <laughs> well, at this point, it's it's, pro it's probably too late in the day to get something like that. Like, but like next time he he goes to do something, you're like, hey, maybe you maybe you drop your your clothes in a pot or something right after. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah, he probably already put it in the laundry machine. That's obviously yeah. here. Yeah, he has. Yeah, he has. He has probably laundry. He's a good boy. <laughs> no, who knows, man? Um, I'm pretty sure we use the like classic method and always hate it. <laughs> there's well, probably some, we... there's, there's probably some kind of amenity here because again, they really liked this place. This used to be a crawler base, so it had a lot of different amenities. So there's probably a laundry machine here. It's not like it's it's not like it's freaking freaking super super futuristic technology to have a laundry machine. <laughs> it's just you know the water in the satellite isn't amazing. <laughs> I, I I like to think it's coin operated, but they <laughs> unlock the thing where the coins go in, so they just use the coin, put it to the side for the next person. <laughs> Hell yeah! But uh, you were able to you're able to figure that out. If he didn't um, if he didn't do laundry today, you probably could have got a lot more from it. But let's do the actual roll now to see what you can what you can uh, can can hope to to game with this. I need you to roll me potential, and you have one fleeting. All right, potential. We potential. Remember, you can use guidance tokens to give yourself advantage if you want. Oh yeah, those things. Anyway, potential. <laughs> yeah. I like when, when he, like, acknowledges that something no is potential. real, and then he goes, we're good. <laughs> I right, just roll one more time, because you have one from Shock Foxy. Oh, yeah. That's okay. a lot better. That's a 16 altogether. Um, uh, roll me one more time for Fake Person. All right. Whee! Fourteen, okay. Do, 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 do. As you are going through, uh, you made you made as much use out of the out of the small vial as you could. Do me one more. Do me do me one more for fun fungus. Do me one more for fun fungus. Up, oh, we're freezing. There we go for the fungus. 
Nice. I <laughs> apparently Pop the don't like this moment. It's, 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 it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. You get you do pretty well with your uh, with your uh, your first application of this as you are able to to make something uh, that uh, you are you are pretty sure just from the absolute smell of it, it's like nope that's that's uh that's sweat that is whatever that is <laughs> that is something <laughs> you you seem to have been able to make some kind of uh some kind of a a uh, uh a a prototype uh drink quote unquote with with what you got from it you have you have your proto, your proto, your, your, your proto street liquid. <laughs> proto street liquid enhancer. Proto street soda. Street sticky goo. Mountain Dew. You're not sure why you carbonated it, but you carbonated it. It's just habit. <laughs> so, uh, so yeah, you have, you have your... You have your uh That's that's why I taste tested it earlier. It's habit. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna give you a little a little bag. Uh I'm gonna give you one of these little bags here and uh we're gonna we're gonna call it the 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 proto street soda. <laughs> and you you'll need to, you'll need to find some kind of spirit to feed it to, but Oh, I know exactly who I'm getting to. We'll go to the sewer later, but I have a plan. <laughs> Here you go. Here is your proto street soda. I'll put it right, uh, right on the the right side of your of your thing, right beside your your other uh your other speed world card. <laughs> I just noticed you had to. <laughs> uh, and uh, yeah, we'll we'll see how we'll see how that goes. You feel like you did the best with the materials you had at the moment. You don't think you can make another another soda today from it just because of the fact that you didn't have enough to work with. Do you want to spend some time making some more sodas? Yes, please. I need to taste something that isn't sweat and disappointment. Okay, I'll give you I'll give you because you were doing some some things there that you hadn't done before. You can you can make one other soda and like, you know, obviously you can you can taste it and still have like enough to like fill a soda bottle. <laughs> What kind of soda do you are you trying to make here? Uh whatever I have. I forget what ingredients we have right now. You have some general food stuffs at this point. Uh, uh you were you guys were able to get it from uh from the uh the Harborman, so you guys are are pretty okay with with uh, with a lot of different flavors right now. So you could do another experiment and try to have something different if you'd like. A caramel soda. A a Now nah, uh, just look. It's <laughs> I have the taste of sweat in my mouth. I'm going for root beer. I'm going for the old and true method. All right, roll me, roll me a d20. See if you can perfect your root beer. You rolled pretty good on your last root beer, so. Nat one. I mean, nat 20. Yeah, that. You do nat one. Um, yeah. Do you want to take the one or do you want to take the last roll you made for root beer, which I believe was a 16? Nah, let's take the nat one. Let's make <laughs> Prisca suffer. All right, you have one uh, bad root beer soda. She's going to chug it and realize halfway, oh, this is disgusting. Oh, God, there's still some sweat in this. What the hell? <laughs> you made it with you made it with some within the same vial you made the street soda with. Jesus Christ. Yeah, like not intentionally. But like, <laughs> maybe like Deck tried to come to help and like, hey, what you doing here? Can you get, and just and then she accidentally <laughs> switches the vials or something. So you made some street beer. <laughs> <laughs> yep, maybe we got I, street I, beer. I, I I'm like taking that, that from I'm cause... taking that from Fox Spirit. Where you you made some street <laughs> beer soda. I love you some like street should... beer. I feel like it should be called a, a street contaminated beer. <laughs> you have, you have, I feel like you, you have should enough, roll see. You have enough left over to create one uh, bad street beer soda. I put that over here in your in your uh, your little area here. You, you, there you go. It's very nice. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> Chris gives you to question herself. A am I losing my grip? That was such an amateur mistake. What's going on? Am I me? 
you you start as, as you start having your existential crisis. You do also realize you're also very tired. <laughs> I don't realize that yet. <laughs> well, well, we'll get back to that once we once we see what's going uh, going down with with everywhere else. Uh, as uh, we got through you and Otto, uh, we're gonna go Piper. Oh boy, <laughs> Piper, you have made your way uh, out onto onto the uh, the streets of of the satellite. Um, and uh, as I'm feeling you do, very safe right now. <laughs> you're, you're feeling extremely safe right now. It's, it's, it's you're you're super safe. Mm-hmm. You're on your bike. Uh, you, you guys, you have the wind flowing through your hair. <laughs> As you come out, you're like, man, I sh- do we not f- fucking have helmets? <laughs> yeah, I just ended up like, man, I don't like the fact that I'm just completely helmetless. I don't have help. Well, no, you do stop at one point as you try to get a get a get a bearing on things, and as soon as you mention a helmet, oh, oh right, here you go. go. You hear the sound of something popping, as if there's something like 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 slightly opening. You look back behind you as you see the seat uh, of the of the um, uh, of the uh, door runner seems to have uh, popped up very slightly. Uh, upon stepping off of it for a moment, you look under as you see that there's a helmet there. Oh, uh, thank you. I. This is very technology. Uh, this is very hard to say that this is uh, standard order, standard issue, but it does look as if some safety protocols have engaged themselves, and it seems as if they did leave this here. It doesn't very much go with uh, any sort of known color schemes, however, unfortunately. That's fine. Uh, it, it does its job, which is the important part. Thank you. It's just a Hello Kitty helmet. <laughs> it's a Hello Kitty helmet. <laughs> meow, meow, bitches. <laughs> which way would you like to go? Meow, meow, I'm a Dulahan. We can make our way just about anywhere here in the satellite. Uh, I believe that this, uh, this bike here can uh, go up to a very high speed, one that I would not recommend going to the max of. Uh, I would only recommend that in the most dire of circumstances or duels. Uh, it does seem as if it, if you go too fa- too fast with this thing, it does appear to uh, have a high percentage enough of self-destructing. Not in an explosion kind of way, more of a uh, falling apart kind of way. That's at least the small solace we can have. I, I was not expecting to end up today with self-combustion, but you know... I will be sure to keep it within within uh, safe perimeters. Thank you, Gear. Uh, okay. If I was Death, where would I go? God, that's a harder question than I thought it would be. Uh, I'd go face down on the field, ready to be played. I'm glad that Prisca's in my brain right now, telling me all the important stuff I should know and need. Um... Oh, also, let me know if you want if you would like to have any area information. Uh, yeah, thank you. Uh, mm, I think the best thing I can do is just go straight forward and just, I guess, I think that's the best way. I can't think about it too much. Okay. That's, whenever, that's you, the... whenever you say straight forward, uh, can you motion on the map where where it is you would like to make your way to go? Well, this bike is pointing this way, so this is forward. Like over, over toward the, uh, over toward the uh, recycling area. Yeah. Of course, we can make our way to the recycling plant now. Well, that is that is the only place I can think of. In search for deck, we go. Vroom 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 vroom. <laughs> She's making the sounds of the engine. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, Rupert, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> no, no, you can continue. I was just wondering. Uh, as you make your way uh, off to the um, uh, the eastern part of the island, uh, you do look around upon getting here. Uh, again, it is it is it is rather late, uh, so you do note that a lot of the recycling plants have turned off. Uh, you do still see that a couple of the ones at the very top, uh, the very top of the area. Uh, do seem to be still on for the time being, uh, as they are still uh, either get, getting things from the uh, mainland or taking things away from here. You're not entirely sure which one that is. Look, upon looking around, you don't see any other any other like dual runner activity or anything of that nature. Okay, this is definitely not it then. Uh, hmm. Well, fuck. It wasn't this way. It, 
Here, I have, I have kind of a weird question. Of course. If you happen to just do things, right? And mm -hmm. you just... Uh, if, if, you liked, if you liked virtual virtual fighting games and also fighting literally, where, where, in which direction would you go? <laughs> hmm. I do not believe that there is an arcade in the satellite, so fighting games might be hard to come across. Uh, I guess I'm thinking more of like a vibe right now. Oh, um, hmm. probably where there would be a lot of violence, I would think. Potentially uh, somewhere like that. Although, hmm, how do I put it? It doesn't seem very correct to go and do, especially at this time of night, right after you just got warned by Mars. Oh yeah, that is that is definitely a terrible idea, I agree. <laughs> if I were to make a suggestion, hmm? I had mentioned before that I could give you some area information. Uh, I do feel that there are some other dual runners activity happening tonight. All right. What's what's the scoop? I think I, is what they say. I don't have a lot of information. I can't tell you anything exact, but I can tell you that there are, from what I feel, three dual runners active around that are being rather showy about it. I'm able to sense these things because everything is mostly connected through dual runner technology in case there was ever a duel to be broken out. Uh, none of these three seem to have any measures that would stop my detection of them. But I believe that there are three that I can feel right now. Would you like me to show you on the map? Uh, yeah, that, that would work. You look down on the, uh, the uh, screen of the dual runner as you do. You see that there are three areas that seem to pop up. One of them is mm -hmm. around Nya. Nya. One of them is around Nya. And one of them is around Nya. Deco's changed ever since he became a kitty YouTuber. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> you're pretty sure based on... Yeah, how, how hello, kitty YouTuber. <laughs> you're pretty sure based on the location in front of you uh, on the map that, that, uh, that the one that uh, they're pointing to off in this direction is most likely either you or that member of Sector Security you have met before. Yeah, which is definitely not where we're attempting to go. And the other one, there seems to be one off to the south side of the city and one off toward the north, uh, the north, uh, northwest side of the city. They're the only ones that I can really give too much of an idea for. There are most likely more activity happening around the city, but those are the ones that are standing out to me. I can't tell mm -hmm. you how many are there are present either. I can only tell you that that is where I'm feeling any signals. That's 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 fine. Thank you. Uh, yeah. No problem. Mm -hmm. Okay. It probably makes more sense that it would be around this area. I don't feel like it would have gone too far down, although it's just gonna appear. Mm -hmm. Shall we make our way in the in that direction then? That yeah. Let's go. I would suggest by the time we're done with either of these directions, we probably won't have a lot of time to look into the other. Uh, yeah, I, I, I figure that it's like, you know, just points up. But either way, if you don't take too long on one of them, maybe we could. But this is uh, most likely a one or the other direction. Uh, so north, uh, northwest then? Yep, that, sound, that sounds good. Understood. You see that the map uh, in front of you changes. Uh, there, uh, the other two areas seem to erase themselves, and as they do, uh, you see that there is a basically a line show up that is like a good <laughs> like route on on way to to where to go. As as if they Less are literally traffic area. Google Maps. It's literally that. It's literally just like calculating. You know. It's like <laughs> this is the best way to get to this area. It's like thank you. As you head off in that direction, <laughs> 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 
da, da. Northwest, huh? That's very interesting. Do, do. As you make your way off into this direction, uh, you find that uh, the uh, closer you get to the area, the more the area sort of kind of expands as if they can't tell the exact location of where they're looking at. Um, mm -hmm. You do feel that whenever you get close enough, uh, looking around, you don't see anything on the high road, which means uh, the uh, dual runner activity is either in one of these like four districts upon going down. Which would you like to check? I love, I love multiple choice. <laughs> there are no Rhyming wrong answers. has so many options. There are no wrong answers except the ones that are wrong answers. Uh, I'm sorry I'm that, this, going... that this door runner does not seem to have the capability to hone in on the target very easily. I mean, that's probably... That's, that's more of a relief than anything, actually. I mean, in this situation, it's probably not very... You, you get the point. Um, all right. All right. My heart says here. Gonna head over to the northeast? Yep. You uh, steer the dual runner off toward that direction. As you do, um, uh, you see that uh, things seem to become easier to head off there as, um, uh, as the AI of this place uh, starts uh, taking slightly over for you. Not like fully. Uh, you're still able to direct it yourself, but you feel that you're you're doing rather well on on uh, on your first your first door runner trip around. You're doing you're doing pretty good. The first and a half, the other time I was driving on like a princess. I was driving at like three meters. <laughs> That's <per> very hour. <laughs> true. <laughs> uh, as you get there, I mean it's it, it's it's rather it's rather nice uh, having the uh, having the the cold night air uh, going up against you. Uh, the, the, the helmet of your Hello Kitty helmet strapped down. <laughs> <laughs> As you head off into this direction and you do make your way off into one of the uh, one of the the areas, I'm gonna grab a, a new map, please. Give me a good, oh boy! Give me Una Momo. Do, 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 do. You ever lose a deck and have to go out to find it, and then you end up in, like, the street corner halfway across? Da, da, da. Hashtag relatable. Hashtag relatable. <laughs> See, Linda, you're sitting here, but it's like, you ever want to go to sleep when a woman kicks your face out? Exactly, like... Dang it. Well, right, I mean, you got to, to go to again. sleep. <laughs> yeah, but I didn't want to get kicked. You weren't Ooh. kicked. You were hit with a cane. Well, I didn't want to live in poverty. We all have to suffer sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you did choose to. You choose. And Otto's just like, I'm fine. <laughs> you know? Wait, who was that directed at? Hold on. <laughs> well, I mean, <laughs> Piper chose to come to the satellite. Yes, she did. Oh, Preska, you mean? Preska, Preska, fuck. I keep mixing them up. <laughs> I'm so We're all doing oh, it. I wasn't, I wasn't even talking about <laughs> We're all Preska. doing I'm it. I'm changing my name to fucking Jeremy now. This sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Jeremy Irons. <laughs> that sounds like the first one to die in a horror movie kind of name. Oh, this sucks. No, that's Jerome. <laughs> This sucks. I don't have anything. I don't have anything like like on my PC where like it shows where everything is anymore. <laughs> Cause well, because of, of the fucking because uh, of the fucking reset and everything. Da -da -da -da. The theater also, of mind moment. That was a good joke. It was. <laughs> I'll have it. Give me give me Uno Momo really quick. I'm trying to I'm trying keep to get getting away with this. Trying Abby to do... was right. Should have just been named Pippi. No, that's the... <laughs> that's the subway. <laughs> How the fuck are we at the subway? <laughs> I also have to like turn on view for everything so that I can actually see mm -hmm. fucking the uh, the overview of these places because otherwise it's just gonna show me the uh... otherwise it's just gonna show me the um heckin. Uh, like names of all of them instead of like the actual mm. pictures. Yeah. Like file description and all that stuff. Yeah. Da, 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 da. <laughs> it seems we've gotten lost. We're no longer in the residential area. We're in the uh uh 
the Atlantic Ocean. Oh fuck. Oh shit. <laughs> not the Atlantic Ocean. <laughs> That's not very good. There we go. That one will do. Perfect. perfect. <laughs> It's also it also doesn't have a grid. Perfect. Solution makes some great maps. Can we get a shout out to Solution? I, I guess not. Then fuck. Shout sorry, it's, it's, sorry, it's trying to. And his maps. Sorry, it's trying to fucking. It's trying to fucking try to update all of them. And I'm like, no, don't update mm. all of them. What the fuck are you trying to say? You don't. I want to fucking update everything. No, you can do whatever. I mean, these yeah, fucking. Do you want a here. map for your games for Dungeons and Dragons, <laughs> Pathfinder, or maybe even your e roll plays? Oh, then fuck. check well, out. <laughs> I was say, well, we have the solution to your problem, dude. Solution would probably be good with that. We need. To, I need to ask him. It's like, can I use your? Can I use your maps for e roll? <laughs> <laughs> can you get me a sex dungeon? Well, Solution, I'm gonna you, need you. Well, <laughs> I'm gonna need you to make me a well, sex dungeon. You good? <laughs> can you please not joke about about e role plays when I'm I'm walking into a hole like an alleyway? <laughs> you, see it, you see it right here. <laughs> Patreon.com slash solution maps. <laughs> In fact, Solution's about to show you what an e role play looks like. <laughs> Betty Solution's gonna get the belt. <laughs> this is what happens when I don't get paid for my sponsorship. We're still waiting on the Burger King sponsorship. That's true. One day. Mm -hmm. One day. Oh no, this is a strip club! <laughs> look at that, look at that strip club. Oh, it's great. No. <laughs> we can use it for Eero plays. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> well, street, it's time to work the streets. <laughs> God, there I love these. Great... I, I love oh, these so I much. I know a place for you to really gather sweat and other fluids. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Solution, I'm sorry, but I'm not sorry. I'm not. You made this. <laughs> As Piper, you make your way uh, into this area. As you do, uh, you find that um, uh, upon getting here, uh, I'm gonna make I'm gonna make the map a little bit bigger because it looks like your your dual runner is about the same size of a car. <laughs> that was a huge <laughs> dual runner. There we go. Perfect. Don't worry about anything else. Everything, everything, nothing, Don't worry happening. about the clipping of the world. Yeah, yeah. nothing's happening. It's fine. We're fine. <laughs> gonna move them off to the there. Look how look how easy that was. Move them over. Just move them over. <laughs> Bloop. Just move them over. Scooch them. Just do a scooch. There. We're fine. Everything's fine. But yes, as you make your way here, you do find upon uh, getting around the area, you do see uh, what appears to be some door runners in the area. Da -da -da -da. Do, do, do. Let me grab a couple of dual runners. Boing, boing. And boing. Oh, fuck. You see that just outside, uh, that just outside of uh, the buildings over to the over on the the right side of the uh, the area here, you see what appears to be a couple of door runners sitting out. Looking over, uh, there are a couple of uh, people standing outside of said door runners as well. Uh, da -da -da. One of them is Jasna. <laughs> <laughs> after, after, after she left the group, she decided to just dimension hop. <laughs> where the heck is it? Where are they? Where are these boys at? I'm gonna have to take him. Consider. I'm gonna have to take. I'm gonna have to take Officer Don. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh, no, no. have to take oh, him. Jeez. Cuz I couldn't find I couldn't find the generic tokens. There we go. Do, 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 do. <coughs> you see several members of what you can assume are sector security 
however, you can also see that they are not alone. In that area, you also see a number of uh, just just regular looking, regular looking people. Like you, you look, look at those regular people. They're they're just regular, regular everyday. They look like they will use a fire deck. <laughs> everyday, everyday boyos, just hanging out, doing their things. Uh, from what you can tell, uh, the five of them uh, seem to be uh, seem to be rather rowdy. Uh, you can tell, <laughs> looking over at uh, some of the uh, the uh, the sector security door runners, uh, there are some open open containers of alcohol, uh, like just just sitting on just like sitting on the the door runners and like some, uh, in these guys in some of these guys' hands. Maybe <laughs> drinking. <clears> hmm. <throat> <clears throat> Uh, probably better get a whisper. I don't think they. <laughs> I believe that I this is where the signal is probably coming from. That door runner, especially, and the one in the center, appears to be custom made. I believe that might be the one that I was tracking. I mean, it would be. That's pretty. It's very different. I don't believe you find anything like that in the satellite. I could try to cross reference anything hey, if you'd like me to. Did you know the Phantom Thieves? Really? There might be suspicions, yeah. I'll Go let me see if I can figure out anything on the net. As the uh, as Google. you see the uh, you see there is a slight little little swirly on the on the screen as if they are looking through something. It takes it takes a little while. However, eventually gear does sort of uh, sort of perk up. Oh, I believe I found something. What's up? This door runner appears to belong to a pro duelist named uh, Utitu. I say Utitu. Uh, I say that out loud. That is that is actually what I would do. A pro duelist of the name of Yama. That's the other guy, the one that Sano went with, right? I believe so. From what Priska and the rest of you have said. I thought that was Masa. That's just me. It's probably Masa. I honestly, I was just looking over at the at the, the the token, and it said Yama for some reason. I I think it's Yama because it's a Yamaha joke. Oh well, no, it is Yama. I'm thinking. correct. I'm yeah. uh, you. You freaking got me. You got me all all turned around. You got me all turned around, Emerald. Get out of here. I'm sorry. I wrote the name down. I get, get don't know who Masa is then. Maybe I misheard. Get the hell out of here. Like a Yanny Laurel bullshit I'll thing. I'll murder happening. you. <laughs> what is this Skype conversation right now? <laughs> Sorry, I was talking to my fellow AI. <laughs> <laughs> there's another one? Oh, there's several of us. <laughs> cool. This one named Emerald is actually has a bit of a personification. Uh, they look like a they look like a green deer. I mean, I guess that identification would probably be useful in differentiating AIs, but I also I feel like it's going to be kind of weird to say out loud, so I'm not going to keep that sentence on. One day they'll make me a Yu-Gi-Oh card. My OC is really cool, guys. <laughs> Maybe he will have a Yu-Gi-Oh card one day. Whatever Yu-Gi-Oh is. You have to is. get him on screen. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. <laughs> I believe that that door runner is in the possession of a, of a pro duelist named Yama. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay, that kind of opens two possibilities. I don't know if I see that person among the group over there. However, at least yeah, from I the figure, pictures that I, I found. Yeah, you know, pro duelists don't exactly dress like uh, you know, that. Also, those sector security members seem to be indulging in um, activities that don't befit them currently. Copious amounts of alcohol. It seems like. Hmm. Now that I'm looking at the two door runners that belong to them in particular, I don't believe that I find any records of officers who are supposed to be linked with them. Hmm. You think then that they're, uh... I mean, stolen or something? That would be my first thought. But we were also talking with a couple of other people saying that there were new people on the force. Perhaps they just weren't uh, added to the database. I don't see that happening, however. It seems like a Unless very easy thing to, to show someone. 
Hmm. You're probably correct on that. I was going to say unless they had some reason to do so, but if you don't want someone to be found, then it's best not to have records of them. Mm hmm. Hmm. I believe the danger of this place is pretty high. What would you like to yeah, do? I'd... I don't think I can do anything by myself right now, but I also have no idea we'll be able to track that bike later. Hmm. If you would like to approach, I could attempt to make it to where the dual runner is ready to take off at a moment's notice, but again, at super high speeds, it could be problematic. I do yeah, think if, you, that... if you've been watching movies here, you know that it is incredibly terrible for one little girl to walk up to, four, to around five drunk guys. I didn't want to mention that. Yeah, that's the part that I'm saying. It's kind of, hmm. It's a little sus. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna have to bend. <laughs> a little sus. <laughs> Just a little. <laughs> yeah, let's get out of here. I'm not. As if you... anything, we assume that Beck is dead. I'm done. <laughs> As you make your way going forward, you do do a turn. Uh, you do see them. You do see them look to you in your direction. But as soon as you turn to take off, it's like they'd have to be like, "Fucking hey, fuck that person in particular." Let's get on our bikes, guys. <laughs> there we go. They have all been. And then he drops. I love how his name is Red Among Us. And we have Purple yep. Among Us. Yeah. We have Skirmish, Mr. Everyday Boy. Clyde, Mister Everyday Boy. <laughs> Just a couple of Everyday Boys. <laughs> But yes, as you as you turn to make your way away, we put you back on back on map. After isolating those um, uh, those bikes there, I believe there's still some sort of a signature around here. Then my at this point, I don't think she'd be here at that point. But you know, while we're here, I may as well keep looking. Hmm. If you'd like to try any of the other places in particular, you can. Uh, well, I guess if they were here, we could just go parallel. All right. You make your way over into the into the opposite area. Upon doing so, <laughs> it's the same five drunken guys in the same body. The exact same fucking <laughs> drunken guys. You found them again. It's it's uh it's a little it's a little it's a little embarrassing. Um, man can't believe that they be like that, you know? What like, a blunder, you know? Come on, like, come on. Falling for one of the classic blunders. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You find your way uh, into this area upon getting there and uh, looking, uh, looking around from where you are. Uh, you find yourself on the bottom. You stop around through here as you do see that there is a, another dual runner around. Do, 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 do. Where is... There it is. I, mean, I guess I could have did it from yours, but, you know, whatever. Bloop. And... You see what green appears, guy deployed. You see what appears to be a um, uh, a man over by his dual runner. Uh, you see that he is looking around nervously, uh, but he seems to be alone. After isolating this one, it does not appear there's any more signatures in the area. And that at least clears that one up, which uh, is on one hand bad news. Yes, yeah, we'll just means that deck went to the south. Yeah, we'll just pretend she's dead. All right. Uh, okay. <laughs> we'll mourn her in the morning if we don't see her. Uh, just one guy, though. That's strange. Would you like to approach? It might be worth approaching. 
But you have to make the noise. <laughs> <I'm fine. laughs> She's just like. <laughs> you wish to you wish to approach this green man's. Yeah, this is totally fine and not gonna backfire in any way. I give up at this point. Uh, as you make your way over toward Green Man's, uh, you see Green Man's uh, looks over towards you as you approach. Uh, he seems to lean up against his bike for a moment uh, as you get here, and he looks out to you. Hey! Hey! Nice bike! Yeah, uh, nice on yours as well. Uh, any particular reason to hang in your trash can? Oh, you know, just, uh, just hanging by the trash, you know? I mean, yeah, it's the best place to put bikes. I would know that myself. <laughs> I haven't seen you around. Uh, you new to, you new to dual runners? To dual runners? Yeah, 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 run. Abort, 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 abort. So do you come to this trash can often? <laughs> you see a pillow and a blanket in the trash can. We gotta get out of here. Finally, a kindred spirit. <laughs> yeah, this is relatively new. Oh, well, I mean, uh, Obviously, we haven't seen a lot of people going through. Most of us don't ever bring these guys out until it's uh, pretty late at night, as you probably understand why. Uh, mm -hmm. This one here, he's like motion over toward the one he's on, kind of gives it a pat. I'm thinking about selling her tonight. But really? obviously, but obviously, you're not my client. You have one already. Mm -hmm. uh, but they haven't shown up yet. It's supposed to have been here like an hour ago. <laughs> Hmm. You have their description? I might know them. Uh, how, how do I put it? I, I don't really know <laughs> how to really go about it. Uh, the guy on the phone said he would be dressed uh, sort of <laughs> casually. Uh, said he'd have a, a kind of normal look about him. Kind of, kind of the yay, yay-sized face. is is Kind of weird. Uh, something about a something about a necklace. He's supposed to have a necklace on him. Uh, any kind of <laughs> particular necklace. <laughs> I think it was supposed to be all blue or glowy or something. In a little extended flashback sequence, what did <laughs> Reader's necklace look like? It, it, it looked uh, decently similar until like the thriller stuff happened and it turned red. But uh, before that, it was blue and glowy and stuff. <laughs> Maybe Riku is the client. Maybe Riku is the client. That's not true. <laughs> remember? No, I, no. So, if I remember right, that was also the guy you stole the entire deck from. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> that that guy is in crutches now and in the open sea. <laughs> that guy is not even a character anymore. You broke his what hands. Your... <laughs> you yeah, broke the his thing hands. He driving. What is your deal with throwing things in the ocean? Stop killing the dolphins, Piper. <laughs> Fuck the dolphins, they eat people! <laughs> Fair enough. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, if oh, it's oh. The guy I'm thinking about, I think he may no longer have hands for a few weeks. I am not going to ask you about that. <laughs> Yeah, I that have sounds... no, I don't have, I don't know the details either, so okay, you and I, I are in the same place. I, th I thought you might have, I thought you might have, you know, got at him. No, uh, I'm, no. You know, okay, okay, make, uh, just make, uh, sorry, I'm just making sure. Uh, <laughs> I'm uh, not a lover or a fighter, I'm I, mostly just a runner. I just thought you cut off their hands. <laughs> <laughs> and then they uh, throw them back? Ah, uh, damn, uh, I mean... I was kind of having some second thoughts about selling her anyway, but uh, kind of needed the money. Uh, that's a pretty, pretty big amount, but if he's not going to show up, I'm not going to stay here all night and risk sector security finding me. <sighs> like, looks back to the bike. Hmm. <sighs> I 
I ain't got nothing else to do tonight. You want to ride? Well, I lost track of what I was trying to find today, so I guess that's... Yeah, fuck it. Cool. Uh, I'm just, I just mostly try to stick around until, I don't know, it gets too dark to go around most of the city. But, uh, yeah, if you're feeling like it, I'm just going to take a couple of rap laps around the satellite before getting back home. Yeah, that's... It's usually best to ride with somebody else with you just in case something happens. I heard some guy got ran off the road the other night. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I heard all about it. Hmm. That was a hard drop. And a few broken ribs. Oh, uh, I mean, if that's all he got out of it, he's lucky. <laughs> I feel kind of sorry for this guy. Like, uh, yeah, they lost use of their hands. Oh, yeah, they broke a few ribs. Dude, this guy, this guy grew up in the satellite. He fucking, he fucking understands. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. Yeah, Sometimes he understands. Your arms. Piper's the leader, right? <laughs> you it's like, yeah, you understand, you know, ever since Doc left the satellite, she's been driving around here. <laughs> Man, ever since we ever, ever since we lost ever since we lost our only fucking doctor, everyone, people have just yeah, been dying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's just let's just go for it. Okay. Du -du -du -du. You it's see like that... at this point, what deck is dead? We're more here in the morning. <laughs> you you see him get on the bike and he starts making his way uh, over. You see him heading up toward the um, uh, up toward the um, uh, the the um, uh, the upper the upper roads. Uh, as um, uh, you see him head off, do you you wanna you follow want to follow after him? Are yeah, you sure follow. you wanna Are you sure you wanna drive with this person? You don't know anything about them. Yeah, it's, it's, I know absolutely, but at this point, I would rather just see where this goes. Uh, how do I explain this to you here, right? Uh, mm -hmm. If you ever feel like there's opponents near you, then that's probably you heading in the right direction, except I don't fully agree with that sentiment. I'm just... I got chased by a serial killer five, like, 15 minutes ago here. Things... Let me just have this. Uh, definitely. Sorry. I didn't mean to uh, go at any of your nerves that are already pretty shot. If you want a relaxing drive, then then perfect. I can try to uh, keep around his speed. Yeah. Sorry. It's no problem. As he makes his way up to the to the top or uh, to the top of the uh, the highway, I'm gonna grab our little highway map. I never get to use. Let's fucking Hell go. Yeah. Bam. <laughs> so That's guys, I've been planning. I've been planning for a new character. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no no it's fine it's fine he just looks over at you he's like I was the one who ran him off <laughs> <laughs> and he pulls out a gun and he's like you got a gun and he's like yeah it's pretty neat <laughs> yeah it's pretty neat <laughs> it was me Barry I run him off the road <laughs> physically ran him off <laughs> I was just making street juice, and you were having a romantic drive with a stranger. <laughs> <laughs> You're about to talk about rib cages breaking, hands being decapitated. Ah, uh, you know it. My favorite fucking glove topics. There's a little. They big. aren't. <laughs> All right, putting those away from the topics to talk about. There we go. There we go. All right, we'll do that. That seems a little bit better. <laughs> social distancing. Social distancing. Yeah, yeah, you're doing it. But Distant socialing. As you, uh, as you start making your way, uh, making your way through, the two of you don't really have a lot of time to talk. Obviously, you're on bikes. Um, That's fine. You, you, you put up, you put up your, your, your Hello Kitty, uh, <laughs> or like, I don't know. It's like, it's like, I don't know. The, the, the this, this Copycat? versions. This version, yeah, it's like a copycat. <laughs> you, you put on your copycat uh, helmet and, and uh, you two tune copycat. There we go. <laughs> you two Perfect. just start making your way through. Um, after a little bit, after a little bit of time, uh, you guys start doing some start doing some circles around the, uh, the satellite. You see that every now and then he looks over at you. You see him like move his hand forward as if he's like, "I'm about to turn. I'm about to go further." <laughs> and, like you just see like him speed up whenever he does that. You like. Go to go to uh, keep up with around his speed. He's not like going like super fast or anything, and you never get any warnings uh, from gear as you go forward. 
We're not we're not playing in the hard times. We're not going like, all right, boys, we're going max velocity. As you guys are are going around, uh, you do see that eventually uh, he does seem to turn off uh, from where uh, from where he is. Uh, whenever you get around to the the southern part of the city, um, as he turns off, you see that he looks as if he's heading toward one of the roads that lead to the underground. This guy's fucking crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to follow? <laughs> I'm just gonna wave over like, "Yo, where you going?" You see him uh, as you as you as you go to like as you go to like get his attention. Uh, he slows down slightly, turns a bit to to get the um, uh, the bike to stop. You stop as well with gear. As he just looks back, he's like, "What? Never been on? Never went for a drive around here?" Yeah, this is definitely uh outside my perimeter. There's a loop. Uh, there's a loop around under the city. It looks like it's like an underground, uh, like like kind of part to the subway or whatever. It goes around in a circle around this area and comes right back out, going up to the upper. If you don't want to go down yeah. there, that's fine. We can just stick around to the top. I'm just kind of thinking about it. It's like there's a loop underneath the fucking underground. New information gained, I guess. <laughs> You guys haven't been to the south part of the city really a lot. <laughs> well, we hate the south. <laughs> <laughs> and fucking quote me on that. Let's go down. <laughs> you go to follow him. Uh, there's like a little thing right here. If you look like it, it looks it, le- uh, it leads uh, from the from the um, uh, upper from the upper highway down into the into the darkness. If you look right here. <laughs> yeah, you know what? It's fine. I'll die. <laughs> I just point me to the here. Like if I get kidnapped, I don't give a fuck anymore. You know. As the two of you uh, head down, uh, you do note that whenever you get around the wall, obviously uh, you hear gear kind of like mentioned to you. I'm going to be going dark for about 60 seconds whenever you make it over to the other side. Understood. And again, right whenever you guys get away from the uh, get away from the wall and I'm back because um, <laughs> earlier because <laughs> earlier um, uh, that Prisca had figured that out about it. So they, they know at that point. <laughs> You head down into the into the underground. Uh, you guys start doing some some area some like loops around the area here, like going back around and forth, uh, before finally coming out on the other side, uh, heading up into into the upper highway from this side. Uh, nothing really eventful happens uh, while you're down there, though. Would you like to roll me for your instinct? Yeah, man. You know what? I like using these inspiration. I'm feeling saucy today. Heck yeah. Today, I decided to choose violence and other uh, potential- I mean, not even violence. Today, I decided to fucking forfeit my mission and and just go on a fucking bike ride. Nobody ever knows anything. Riku's still dead. Uh, We'll mourn them all in the morning. Uh, 18. Uh, 19, 20 with the instinct. 20. Uh, as you, uh, as you go to the under part of that, uh, you come back up and, uh, kind of stop with him, uh, upon getting out from the area. But while you were down there, you did note that you passed by, uh, quite a lot of junked, uh, not only dual runners, but other, other kinds of vehicles while you were down there. It looked as if this was, uh, this was some kind of a, some kind of a junkyard for, like, a different type, uh, different types of, uh, different types of, like, dual runners uh dual discs other type of things just sort of down there hanging out note taken uh upon coming out they were kind of spread out around the entire area almost like people either crashed while they were down or people had thrown them down from above or different things like that but it wasn't on the major track that he was leading you through um but uh for uh if anybody if anybody wants to if anybody wants to to think about the original 5Ds uh I actually based the south part of this area on the first part that uh you say had gone through when he was testing the speed of his bike he was doing the underground thing. Anyway, um... <laughs> and then we get like a nice little open shot of the light for the metro subway. <laughs> but uh as you uh, as you see that and as you uh go through that area and come up he goes, "See, fun, right?" as he stops. Yeah, yeah, fine. Dual runners let you take out all three of the different levels of this city. The top, the uh, the mid, and of course the bottom. There's a couple other places you can go down, but the loop there is uh, honestly the best place for anybody just looking for a free ride. Hmm. I was barely even aware it was there. I don't normally head to the south that often. That's pretty, uh, 
pretty noticeable when a lot of people uh, go there. A lot of people, when they get their first Door Runner, want to go and make their way down there and do a bit of a joyride, at which point you then remember uh, the, there was a person that uh, got on a got on a Door Runner recently and went off for a joyride. <laughs> I love information. <laughs> it just like just like goes like, God damn it, that's where she was. <laughs> Upon you guys getting out, uh, you do see that there is uh, a bit of a gathering outside of this place. Do, 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 do. Ba, ba, ba. You see what appears to be a familiar face a little bit ahead of you. And some unfamiliar faces as well. I'm glad that I can finally turn them in directions. <laughs> yeah, look at you. Now they get there parked and shit. Let's get Milk Drinker out of here. Milk Drinker's not a part of this. <laughs> milk Drinker get nothing. But it's calcium power. It's too much to bear. You see what appears to be uh, a uh, a familiar looking face off uh, off a little bit away from you, looking as if he's he's uh, he's doing a, he's doing a chat with some people. As you see uh, you see your friend here, he goes, ah, "You want to do a stop off with them? See if they have anything to drink." No, yeah, I'll, I'll I'll be I'll be I'll be I'll be going now. Uh, you have a good one. Oh, uh, all right. I'll see you later then. Yep. You good? Don't even worry about it. Just getting kind of late for me. Hmm. You know how to get back from where you are? Yeah. She's just gonna like eyes gonna square on Tank the whole time. Tank's yeah. chatting with a boy, doing doing some chats. <laughs> He's just standing there menacingly. <laughs> As uh, he looks to you, he's like, "Yeah, it's probably pretty late." All right, let's make her. Let's get out of here then. As he starts to turn away, getting away, you start making your way from the very, uh, very edge of this area. I'm gonna roll for Tank. <laughs> Tank says his vibe. I've never wanted him to succeed more in my Tank's life. Tank's about to fucking vibe check. I would like to see the vibe check in real time. <laughs> Tank fucking sees nothing. He got a two. <laughs> the dude is already drunk. <laughs> but what about Lincoln Park? Well, Wait, Lincoln Park isn't there. here. What the fuck are you talking about? There two unnamed guy two and I'm gay guy three. <laughs> it's perfect. As you guys, uh, you guys um, uh, head off the head in that direction, you like watch Tank as you do see that he seems to he seems to slip the person that he's talking to. Uh, what what appears to be uh his uh his uh credit his credit chip area. It looks like they're making a transaction. Uh, as the as the person Tucker here apparently. Uh, motions, uh, motions over toward the over toward the the other door runner, and Tank makes his way over to it. Just like for a half split second, like when when she reaches here, she's just like, I could take him. We would both die. <laughs> I can run him down right the fuck now. <laughs> you make your way like you make your way like right here, and just you dead ass stop, and it's like safety protocol engaged. <laughs> For a second, for a second, she's like on this little area. She's like, I could fucking kill him. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it looks like he was just he was just paying for something, man. He looks like he was he was paying for something, and I don't know, he's just doing his. Own. Well, I'm glad that he's been Kmart right now. I don't fucking. <laughs> <laughs> the two. Oh, of no, you... I was looking at the wrong thing. <laughs> The two of you make your way uh, back around. Uh, you see that once you get uh, toward this area here, uh, he looks um, he looks off uh, like he's gonna turn off. But you know that you, you know that uh, the place that you're going is very close to this area. As, yeah, so this is where. Yeah. Yeah. As, uh, <laughs> his his name is uh, Eb Elbard Thon. Elbard Thon. Yeah. That's oh, his name now. Elbard Thon? Is that how you say Eobard? I don't know who wrote who it. Who the fuck wrote this? Uh, me is a flesh joke. Eobard Thon. Eobard Thon. <laughs> anyway. Um, Dude's got a name. He got a fucking name, man. 
Everybody's People are hearing names like Half and Ely and Lincoln and Park and stab each other. So just like Eobard. As he as he goes to turn, you stop. Uh, as he goes, and <laughs> stops and like looks back. He's like, I can't wrist slide. Oh, this is where you heading off? Yep. All right. See you later. If you see anybody looking for a bike, I he like motions and kind of pats down on the one he's there. I don't want to get rid of her, but I do need the money. Hmm. I'll I'll make sure. Uh... You have a name? Uh, apparently it's Eobard. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, no, he... I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, uh, you can you can call me Thawne. All right. I'm Piper. I'll see you later, Piper. If you ever want to go for a joyride again, let me know. Again, it's always good, good to have somebody with you. <laughs> yeah, good luck with the the cell, Thawne. <laughs> He makes the noises. Um, no. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly the one making the <laughs> That's the only fun you have to satellite is when you get on your fucking dual runner and you make the noises. I mean, it's, it's, it's out of everything, things. out of everything, you see that that guy probably had the most enjoyment out of almost anybody you've seen in the satellite. <laughs> like that guy is the happiest guy in all the satellite. Most people fucking most people don't have a lot of a lot of things going for him, but he seemed like as soon as he got on his bike and started going around. He's like, oh, you started being happy. Oh, what about, what about you, Piper? Did you enjoy your joyride? It's called a joyride. Come on. I, I <laughs> met someone again, and I didn't die again. Hey. This was a positive experience. Hey. <laughs> As Thawne makes his way away, you turn, I'm guessing, and head back over toward uh, toward the hangout. Yep. You get outside of the area, you you grab on to the to the cord and start yanking on it. <laughs> and I'm guessing that Otto eventually or somebody goes and presses the button, lets you back Definitely in. Definitely Otto. <laughs> and as you Otto's been standing there. It's He's there. just standing there. Menacingly. <laughs> And as you come back in, you see you see that there's uh there's another one there's another one parked by <laughs> <laughs> as just like leaning over toward like the toward like the truck, seemingly just chatting with a uh, uh with a uh, freaking rudder and and a kiwi. It's like, hey, where'd you go? <laughs> Piper doesn't even talk. She just goes to put the bike over. And then she slowly walks to like around this tarp yeah okay <laughs> just gonna sleep here now <laughs> this tarp is fine as you just sort of like lean up against the um, uh, the car which by the way the tarp is over is over on is over on the the security bike now <laughs> i love i love i love cold car i will sleep <laughs> here i love it cold so rusty car <laughs> about the same density as my original surgery table i'm fine <laughs> i could sleep on the fucking floor if i wanted you just go over as like you lay, as like you lay there you're just like you just say oh hold on hold on <laughs> she makes her way over to you as she does she just goes over to the to the to the car she puts a she puts a, a key in unlocks it there you go and then she moves away <laughs> Thanks, Doug. <laughs> you just climb in. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you just climb into to the junky car. And you like, yeah, you, like put the, you like put the seat back and just lay down. <laughs> yeah. It, it still has a little bit of couch. It's still better than my surgery table. It's <laughs> true. <laughs> you got you got some. This is like some. This is like some nice fake leather. It's great. <laughs> <laughs> But yes, as you guys uh, eventually, because I'm sure that eventually Otto and Prisca, after doing their things, would eventually go and lay down as well. Um, yeah. You guys would wake up the next day. There's no, there's no, uh, there's no, there's no interruptions in the morning. There's no, there's no talking with, uh, with Card Gardner. Oh no. Card Gardner is dead, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> well, Otto say starts off not good. <laughs> oh no, no card card no. There hasn't been any, there hasn't been any 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 changes, I don't think. Let me go and make sure over here, make sure that there's nothing set up. Nothing. No, the ritual change. No, no, no. Everything's yeah, everything's good. Um there hasn't been any there hasn't been any any need for for changes or anything like that. Uh as you guys would be waking up for the day, uh Riku. <laughs> Hi. 
I'm Riku. You would also be be waking up for the day. <laughs> How are you doing, mm-hmm. Riku? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. You see, Let's Riku. Out here. <laughs> look at the danger. Kind of sigh. You wake up. Uh, you feel you feel like uh, like when you're looking around, there doesn't appear to be much of anything around. There's a ninja there. Um, mm-hmm. <laughs> And uh, they seem to they seem to have uh, they seem to have their uh, their arms bound and you, they they're just kind of like looking over at you. <laughs> oh, first time. Not not. Uh, give it a second. So Deco Riku's probably tied a few people up and got tied up before, right? Yeah, probably. <laughs> it, can I use a trick to? Attempt for him to untie himself. You can, but it will be an experience check. Gotcha. So roll Use me. Your experience so roll game. me pretty high. Uh, you have to you have to roll a cool. roll a pretty good trick. Uh, but if you if you I'll get if you get it, the then I'll, I'll go with it. You also have some fleeting. Oh yeah, I'll still take the token. Okay, you have three fleeting. Cool. Eighteen. Eighteen. Oh wait, I didn't roll this as well. Oops. There we go. That would have been a cool. 19 all together. Gotcha. <clears throat> so, yeah. Third roll. And is this the last roll? Yep. Duh, duh, duh. 19 was my haste. I'll say that as you, uh, as you uh, kind of go back and look over to it, you see that you're not you're not tied like like extremely securely. Um, you do feel as if you are uh, you are mostly been you have mostly been hastily thrown in thrown in here. You see that the um, uh, the areas that you have are they they seem to be you seem to be tied with some cor- some sort of like bungee cord. Uh, so like it really just it really just came uh, comes to finding a a good spot and then just using all the strengths you have to stretch your way out as much as you can. It takes you a bit. Uh, because you are, you are, you know, you're, you're, mm-hmm. you're tied decently well, but, uh, you do find the strength to eventually maneuver your, um, one of your arms out, and then you just sort of take the other one off. There we go. Uh, you did not, you did not sleep am- amazingly well last night, mm-hmm. so I'm going to, I'm going to say that, uh, you have, you're gonna have a, a, a temporary, uh, a temporary minus on, uh, on some, on some of your stats really quick. They're they're only temporary. I wouldn't too, I wouldn't worry too much about them. Mm-hmm. But on uh, three of your stats, you are gonna have a temporary little little uh, little menace. We're gonna make them red gotcha. so, that you can, so that you can determine from them. We're gonna have a temporary minus one to resilience, mm-hmm. a temporary minus one to your finesse, and a temporary mm-hmm. minus one to your willpower. Cool. That still means you you have like three fucking resilience. We're good. Yeah. King shit. Uh, your your health is fully back. You have everything everything going uh, going pretty well for you. Uh, you did you do you doing pretty good. Uh, the other guy just sort of the, the ninjas sort of like just like looking at you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Give me a second. <laughs> Rika just cracks his neck and ties ninja boy. You untie the ninja man's as he looks to you. He he like kind of like ru- he like kind of like rubs his uh, rubs his wrist for a moment and then stands up, it's just looking around the room. Oh, uh, by the way, did you find any more of her cards? You see him nod as he pulls out what appears to be several more versions of him. <laughs> Good enough. Good enough. <laughs> you see that there are that there are several versions of whatever whatever the whatever this guy is cosplaying as. Mm-hmm. Whatever, whatever his cosplay card is. <laughs> Riku's gonna quickly look around the room if there's something solid he can use to, you know, bap a person. Uh, you start looking around, you see that most everything here is in very secured boxes. Uh, as you mm-hmm. go to each of them, uh, you see that they are addressed to all, all kinds of places over around the world. Upon going to one of them and one of them at the top, you see that there is uh, there is one from uh, that seems to be addressed toward Crash Town, 
Uh, it seems um, mm-hmm. uh, the uh, the uh, thing listed on there seems to be uh, home appliance. From what it from what it seems to say, as if it, almost as if it's like almost like an Amazon package or something. It's not saying what exactly cool. is there, but it's like oh, this is something like that. Um, as you begin looking through things, each of them are bound in a very in a very tight uh, in a very tight uh, kind of wiring that you're like you're pretty sure if they had that around your arms, you probably might not have been able to get out of it. But they just sort of bungee corded mm-hmm. you. <laughs> it seems that mo- whatever gotcha. this stuff is is more important than keeping you bound. Yeah, figures. <laughs> the Rika's just gonna step out. You go to step out. Uh, you go to the door. The door seems to be unlocked. Cool. He'll just walk out. <laughs> oh, wait one second. He'll go back into the room. Take a few boxes. You go to grab. Uh, you go to grab um, one of the boxes. Uh, as you as you do, you just hear from further in there. I wouldn't do that. The figures. You can come out now. You just see. You just see the uh, the the ninja boy uh, as he's looking across where the uh, where the uh, the sound had uh, where the sound had come from. Uh, as uh, you you see that uh, that the sound seems to come from the room directly on the opposite side of where you guys had came out from. Yeah, I'll go look to inspect the voice closer. You go to open. You go to open. Uh, you go to go to the door. You just see what appears to be there is a woman inside. Uh, it seems to be a restroom, <laughs> but uh, mm-hmm. you see that she appears just be washing her hands and like washing her face over at a, over at a sink. So I'm guessing you had fun yesterday. Oh. What do you mean? Mm. Turns around. You know. You got out of that a lot. You got out of that a lot quicker than I thought you would. Listen. You use a bungee cut. And I was not the one that went through everybody's place here. This is far Mm. beneath me. Okay, I'm guessing it was Ninja Boy then. Yeah, I found him going through my stuff whenever I came home. Great. God, you just see you just see him like looking back at you, looking left, looking right. <laughs> Girl, did you even pay taxes here? <laughs> I am so tempted to get you to get tied up again, but you know, it's a new day. I'm gonna start off calm. What? Did you like it? No. <laughs> you said you were tempted. I can do it anytime you want. No. I was talking about him. Bow, 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 bow. <laughs> Either uh, way, don't touch my stuff. As, as as she goes back to like wiping her face, you look at the uh, you look at the mirrors that she's looking into. You see, there's like a tiny space for like her face, and then there's a bunch of like little squares all around the mirror that show different rooms in this place. One of them seemingly showing the room you were just in. Oh yeah, magic mirror, cool. No security cameras, but close. <laughs> Are you a dual spirit or not? Now, where would someone like you know something like that? You're literally Piper's card. <laughs> uh, I, so I guess you would call me something of the sort. But I guess it's a little bit different for someone like me. Well, I guess you're a little God. bit different too, aren't you? Oh yeah, I'm a psychic dealer. Whoop de do. You even know those terms. Yeah. Unfortunately I don't know what it means, so You hand me a towel, would you? I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> she like motions just over to the corner of the room, you just walk in. <laughs> do, 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 do. Ah, I can't even get you in. Dang it. Oh. Yeah, there we go. We're like at, we're like right at the edge of the room, so it's hard to like remember <laughs> things. E. You go in, you you grab you grab towel, you hand it over. Oh, you're rather nice to somebody who just tied you up for a night. Again, I wasn't I was in a great mood, <laughs> and also you could have just not hit me. I could have. We could have spoken like adults. That's true. 
<laughs> mm-hmm. What? And nothing. Nothing. <laughs> I just wanted to get a good night's sleep. Well, I'm glad you got one. One second. Let me move. I don't want to talk to you while yep. I'm in the bathroom. Come on. Fine. <laughs> Like that even matters. Like what even matters? Excuse me, Ninja Boy. Uh, <laughs> location of a convers. Never mind. Uh, is there any <sighs> spe apart from him stealing from you or attempting to do anything else he did? Well, I thought you were gonna come in because of the other thing that happened, but apparently you guys just don't care. Well, what's the other thing? Well, I mean, I did try. I did try to take, uh, well, a certain thing from you guys, and then you guys took it back. Oh, the painting, the painting, the painting. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you definitely need a brushing up on your art skills, by the way. It's not about the art skills; it's about sending a message. I mean, you can send a better message with better art. Not everybody can be skilled at everything, you know. My skills just yeah, happen to but, be in other places. But everyone can try. But again, you just sort of come in here and take the other painting and don't say anything. Come on. To be fair, that was mainly pi pi Piper, so, you know. <sighs> Whatever. Shrug. You guys are friends, right? Mm-hmm. Just like going through cabinets. <laughs> oh, I... Well, it just seemed like that was the only thing of real value in this entire apartment, so I thought, you know, might as well take it, see what happens. Ah. Uh. She seems to grab, like, uh, some bread and just throws it in a toaster and starts making her way over to the, um, uh, to the, uh, little, little, like, area here, like, where you see there's a bunch of different things, just, just, mo just monitors and, like, other things just thrown on there. Uh, they don't seem to be turned on or doing anything currently, but she just sort of, like, moves it out of the way uh, and sits down. Mm. You want toast? Yeah, sure. Well, get up and get it. What am I, your mom? No, but I'm your guest, apparently. You're not really a guest. You're just you're kind of more of an intruder. <sighs> Technicalities. <laughs> it just goes to get the toast. <laughs> <laughs> hey, pick mine up while you're there. Why am I your slave? Do yourself. I mean, I, you know, I wouldn't really call you a slave or anything like that. I'd say that, you know, it's really nice of me to not go completely uh, against somebody or a pair of somebody's who come into my house. Tell me, why was he after I this? You see after. that she pulls out uh, a card and places it onto and places it in front of her. You see that it is uh, a pair of cards. One of them appears to be uh, the um, uh, the card that you own, uh, Sasuke, and the other one appears to be um, uh, they're looking like this boy. Oh, um, I'm gonna say his her his partner lost her cards. I say lost. I mean they were stolen, and he's been trying to get them back. And I see he hasn't been effective at that. <laughs> well. If they have some kind of value, but it doesn't seem like he's needing these in particular. I'm not even sure if he really has any real direction. Honestly, it looks I... like he's just grabbing the same thing over and over. Whenever I searched him, he had like 12 of this one. Yeah. 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 <laughs> uh, give me a moment. I'm having a crisis here. Mm-hmm. <sighs> It looks over to Ninja Boy. Okay, you're staying with me, right? He, like, looks at you, looks around, shrugs. <laughs> you owe me one. You're staying with me. <laughs> really have a way with, cool. you really have a way with spirits, huh? I mean, I guess. Eh, it's like people, but easy, I guess. Well, I'll tell you what, if something like that was stolen, then obviously there was a stealer. Mm. Somebody out there looking to get a bit of a thrill out of it or getting a, a quick buck. 
If you're wanting to take it back, then you gotta do something more than just be in the shadows. You never know when someone like me is gonna show up. Someone whose eyes are a little bit better than most out there. If you're looking for somebody like that, though, I can potentially help you out. That would be great. <laughs> Although nothing is free, so what would you want? Well, I mean, you said it yourself. One of your friends does have uh, something that bears a bit of a resemblance to me. Mm-hmm. <laughs> nothing really. Nothing and nothing that uh nothing that out of the out of the ordinary. I just uh Well I want that painting back. Okay, one second. Uh, calls Piper on to do this. <laughs> Piper, you don't get woken up you don't get woken up by uh you don't get woken up by, by card gardener today, but you do you do feel that uh Something is, is going down in your dual disc and eventually just go, Piper, it appears that uh, one of your friends is contacting you. <laughs> the one time that it, that fucking car doesn't show up. You're also pre you're also inside of a car right now still. I, I didn't know if I should tell you that. I, I, no, you I probably know. I was... understood. <laughs> it seemed like you were just really tired and I didn't want to, I didn't want to interrupt you. This is where I want to be gear. Okay, uh, sorry. Of course. It's It's... Okay, who's calling? It appears to be Riku. Oh fuck! All right, pick up. <laughs> hey, Piper. Hey, Riku. Hey, so you know that painting? Which one? The good one. Yeah. Yeah, Phil Seeker wants it. What? <laughs> Phil Seeker. The card. She knocked me out That's, yesterday. Do you know how little that narrows it down? There's two. Oh, right. Um, the thief one. Okay. It would have been weird if it was the gun guy. Uh, Why I am I taking this conversation in full game? <laughs> I believe it is because you are very tired and you are done with a lot of things that have been happening recently. Thank you, Gear. Are uh, you also done with things? I'm done with things. This car is very nice, Rekia. Yeah. <laughs> but the painting, what was done as she wanted? Uh, I don't know the specifics. You could ask her. Yeah, I'll put you on loudspeaker one second. You have no idea how to do that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'll put no, you that's on loudspeaker. <laughs> sits there in silence. Okay. Um, <laughs> speak louder, I guess. <laughs> Why do you want the painting? <laughs> you just see, you just see, uh, you just see Shadow Thief look over at you, Riku, as this happens. She obviously probably heard it. <laughs> you know, oh, you're my. being really difficult. Am I? <laughs> I just want it. Uh, Why? Uh, she just wants the painting. Mm. <laughs> also, she'll help out with the whole um, Sano's card thing. Why do people want these weird fucking pictures? All right, fine. Thank you. I'm gonna go get new supplies later anyway, I guess. It'll only cost like an arm and a leg, but it's fine. We'll work for it. No, no, no. Yes. If you're looking to make get new supplies, I could get you some. Uh, she said she can get you some new supplies. You really want that painting? Yeah, all right. <laughs> Not only do I want that painting, but if you're going to paint more, I want those as well. She wants all the paintings. I think she collects NFTs. <laughs> <laughs> a fucking what now? No, no, no. NFTs. They're not for me. <laughs> what? I know someone who can pay top dollar for something like that. Not to mention, whenever they're done with them, some interesting things happen. The way is <laughs> cold. Wait a second. <laughs> Wait, a second. the keeper. Of... Uh, I'm I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. 
it, it's, it's, it's an acronym, I think. C Keeper of Heroic Legacy, I think is what you're trying there to say. There we go. That's the one, yeah. yeah. It is the Henry Pace top for it. Well, I'm not going to tell you my sources. I'm trying to get you a paying woman. Work with me. I'm the one working with you. I'm, gi I'm giving everything here. New supplies. I'm giving information. I'm giving my services. I don't think I need to give everything. Trade secrets. Yeah, sure, fine. Is uh, that all you need? Yeah. Yeah, that's all I need. Is that all right? Yeah, that's I. You, you, you have successfully called me at the lowest possible buying point. I'll tell you that much. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> it feels like an achievement, I guess. <laughs> Wonderful. Get everyone yeah. together and bring him over. You're probably gonna get yeah, you're probably gonna get contacted soon anyway. Why don't you just come over? Because I don't wanna. Oh my god. I don't like I don't like the, I don't like going down there. Didn't she uh, no clip to the ground last time? <laughs> okay, okay. Um can you bring everyone here with the painting? You want all right, yeah, all right, fine. Thank you. Bye bye. <sighs> she seems nice. <laughs> you are not. <laughs> I'm gonna make my toast using your bread. Go ahead. Mm hmm. Do you want anything, Ninja Boy? <laughs> Comes over, nods. Cool. Sits down. <laughs> He's like, food gummy, food gummy. <laughs> Nyan Nyan pops up. Nyan. <laughs> <laughs> As you guys uh, are getting some toast, uh, we got, we got, uh, we got, uh, Piper, you have woken up at this point, uh, getting, uh, looking out the, looking out the, the door, you kind of like, uh, step out looking around everything, uh, you do see that there is a Prisca over by, uh, over by their, uh, their, their workstation, it looks like they had, uh, fallen asleep whenever they were working, and somebody had thrown over, like, a blanket or something on them. <laughs> You see that over by the tarp, uh, you do see that there is a street just sort of like checking on, under it again, just sort of sighing as if he was he was wanting it to be a dream. Um, <laughs> he's 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 going for some shit. Uh, and you see that uh, not not everybody else is really awake or doing much of anything, or you know, if they're here, they're here. If they're not, they're not. Uh, but you do you do see uh, that uh, looking up at the up at the top area where street usually would be, you see what appears to be like a bit of orange hair sticking out from from one of the areas as if uh, as if there is a there is a person laying down up there. Auto spotted. <laughs> you, you see his hair is like hanging off between like, the one bridge, of the railings. Yeah. yeah. You see like a like a little. <laughs> Uh, life is so long. Prisca! Otto! Do I um, wake up? You you can wake up. <laughs> Looks to my vials. Looks to my actual finished drinks. You look to your but two don't trust them. You look to your two finished drinks. As you look to them, there's just a the, the, everybody else is looking at them just these drinks. You see like a dark aura around them. <laughs> <laughs> hey Piper, how was your drive? I did not find Doug. She got here before me, so that's what happened with me. Oh, well, that's what you were doing. I thought you were just, you know, like you're going out just like a vroom. I'm not used to enjoyment, Prisca. How did you enjoy your crimes against humanity? <laughs> Otto, you hear Prisca crying. <laughs> <laughs> Do you get up? At <laughs> uh, first, I taste just yes. <laughs> he thought about it. <laughs> First I taste tested him, and then, because I didn't realize the vial I was using, I chugged a root beer flavor version of him. 
<sighs> this would make a very killer horror movie if we just remove the part where you didn't want to do it. Although I also think that kind of adds to it. It's now the time. Yeah, it is a guy. I'm, I'm, I'm having enjoyment out of this just a little bit. You have to take it. Hi, Ada. Hi. So, how do I explain this? Um, Rika's apparently being uh, held hostage. Oh. Um, what? Auto jumps into action. I was just like, well, time to go to the bikes. <laughs> and uh, let me finish before you start. But you said he's hostage? Can't let me finish. We kind of need to know a location, Otto. So the uh, this chick and she kind of just pulls out the card. You pull out Once... thrill, you, th you pull out a uh, thrill seeker shadow thief. <laughs> yep. She wants my painting, and for some reason, Rika's now in on it. I don't know if it's a cry for help or if he's, you know, in it. Uh, but he, uh, they want us to go there and bring that painting. So that's 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 what at least you know, that's what's happening now. Where is Whoa. there? There is at, uh, huh? They didn't get that much information, huh? <laughs> Gotta call him again. Riku, you get called on 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 your on your uh, on your phone on your on your dual disc, at, at just as you sit down with some buttered toast. <laughs> so where are you gonna go with the bike, Otto? <laughs> Hi, Riku. Where are we supposed to go? Yeah, good talk. Riku. I think Linda left. <laughs> Lindo? Hello? Oh, okay, hey, we are. Hey, you are. I was on mute. Anyway. Yeah. Hey, opposite my apartment. Like, in the other room or another building? In the other room. Okay, all right. Thank you, Riku. Nope. Do you know what? I'm going to get changed. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Bye. That did not sound like a kidnap victim. <laughs> Maybe he's just having found a new roomie at this point. I don't know. I was worried your rat got to him. <laughs> <laughs> you know, there's so many small things in the world. That rat's not one of them, but I'm starting to get over it, you know? <laughs> Baby steps. Uh, uh, I... I for you, I won't think about it too much. Thanks, Prisca. I can always count on you. Does anyone have a drink that's like... Not these? You mean like water? <laughs> you have made several other drinks before and the other day, did you not, Prisca? They should probably be inside of the refrigerating unit yeah. that Street has upstairs. Yeah, you're right. And there's no reason that they would taste different. Which is correct. Do you not want to drink your own soda? You made it a couple of days ago. I chugged it. <laughs> I chugged it. I believe this is one of those things that I don't understand. Did you already drink it all? Is that what you mean? Yeah, I'm kind of lost on this one. Is that what you're saying? I think I think Preska has been uh, has been traumatized by her <laughs> sodas. So even though the other sodas are perfectly fine, they're traumatized. Yeah, like, you see. Have you? ever had a bad taste of a drink like milk or something and you're like was that the milk or was it me and oh, like yes i've had that you have a hard time like wanting pot pot auto please get me some water okay auto's gonna go get water then <laughs> bring it back there you go are you sure that's I'm... sanitary 
<laughs> it's from a bottle. It's fine. I just imagine. You drink the... air if you don't fucking take the water. I just, ima- I just imagine the little <laughs> elephant from fucking uh, from fucking uh, Tarzan. Are you sure <laughs> this water is sanitary? <laughs> It looks questionable to me. It looks questionable I, to me. I'm just gonna have breakfast. And I'm just gonna wait until we're ready to go. Otto's gonna go ahead and just eat his uh his egg, which he's had for a while. <laughs> his his draw bread. Dude, you've been egg. really been holding on that egg one. Not egg, which draw bread. Bread. I don't know if it's an egg, which yet. Ta-da. This is an unopened uh, draw bread, correct? Yeah, We've had this for like two days in game now. Something that like shit that. lasts forever, though. It does, dude. It, 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 it does. <laughs> I know. I'm just trying to remember were when pa- we they got were packed, these. Cause... They were packed by by Dual Academy's best, dude. <laughs> mm-hmm. As you as you go to open up your draw bread, uh, why don't you give me a why don't you give me a d20 roll, my dude? Hell Maybe it'll be a yeah. nice one, or you have a burnt toast. <laughs> Let's see what you oh. get, bro. Twelve. Twelve. Da, 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 da. It's an enjoyable food. You open it up. No. Uh, you find you find that uh, that your uh, that your uh, your sandwich. At first, you get excited because you're like, "That's definitely egg. That's some egg right there." It, it doesn't seem to be the the egg witch. Uh, unfortunately, the mythical the mythical like egg witch that you've that you've been told through all your life is is like the the epitome the of drawing. Witch. Um, You're learning to tell you stories when you were a kid. It is unfortunately what appears to be a breakfast witch. Uh, you see that it is mm. that it is scrambled it is scrambled eggs uh, with some with some uh, with some bakey. Uh, mm. You find some eggs and bakey. Uh, they they taste okay. Uh, you Ooh, you note that yeah. it is specifically mentioned that uh, on the wrapper that this is not the eggs and bakey sandwich. This is the eggs and bacon sandwich. Mm. I wonder what the difference is. <laughs> A lot, apparently. <laughs> also, whenever you open it up, you do find that there is. What is there? What appears what to be what appears to be a voucher. Oh. You find a inside what appears to be a voucher for a, uh, for a for a card pack. You're not sure what card pack it is. It's, it's sort of like it's sort of like like mo- like like kind of scratched off cuz I guess age, who knows. Um mm-hmm. but uh you do see that it is it is good for redemption for 3 cards. Ooh, who do I redeem from? <laughs> who knows, man. It It's probably a your longer pack back when he was at his prime. <laughs> Huh. You find a three-card redemption pack. Interesting. <laughs> I'll one day use, be able to use this. Here's my draw bread. Thank you for the draw bread. Uh, because you've eaten your draw bread as well, it was a 12. Uh, you are going to get a temporary plus. <laughs> to what? This one will be, I'm going to make it red. That way we know we know the difference between it and the other ones. You're going to have a temporary plus to... Your instinct, as well. Oh hell yeah! As your experience. Oh shit! That's a pretty good egg witch. Oh. No, actually, I'm okay. actually, I'm actually, uh, I'm actually wrong. Uh, that was not the that was not the the not egg and bakey witch. That was the egg and bakey witch. It was the that egg was the eggs and, that was the eggs and bakey witch that wasn't the breakfast witch because the breakfast Amen. witch is regular the eggs and bakey witch gives you the plus two. Oh hell yeah! It was the <laughs> eggs and bakey. Oh, you did. Sweet. You got an eggs and bakey witch. <laughs> this is good. You done it. <laughs> I did it, guys. I, we're, we're done with the campaign now. I got the yeah, eggs. All right, everybody can go home. Friend. Everybody go home. <laughs> <laughs> We move the draw bread over here. Uh, and with that being said, uh, do you guys want to do anything before before uh, heading off toward toward Riku? Uh, uh, let's just say for a bit. Riku can play. <laughs> Riku can play. <laughs> Damn. Nah, nah. As you guys uh, get over toward the uh, the dual runners, you do note uh, as soon as you get there. Uh, that uh, you could probably fit two people to a dual runner. However, 
I won't be able to control both of the dual runners whenever you're in whenever you're in uh, whenever you're driving. I can only give the I uh, give one of them my AI. If I were to control both of them, then there would be a chance that whenever I turn for one of them, I would turn for the other, and well, you can see how that might be problematic. Mm. So who's competent in driving? Well, Otto's gonna get on. <laughs> Otto's like, I'm ready. Otto's gonna attempt. Otto, you Otto's get on as you do. You also see. <laughs> oh hell yeah! Thank you. So, are you all leaving? Yeah, we're all. We have to uh, go give this thing. He's gonna. Which is painting two and painting. I'm assuming it's painting one. It's painting one. <laughs> All right. I don't really like being this far south. All right. Uh, uh, they're, they're Otto right. already crashed. <laughs> <laughs> so I was, in a comedic fashion, Otto gets on it and it just slowly tilts to one side. Well, we're going. Uh, we're going north. If you know, back to the apartment. If you want to come, we can probably squeeze. Nods. Hang on, All I right. It. I got it. I got it. I got it. I, I don't got it. I'd like. I'd like <laughs> I to know. I'd like to know who wants to be on the one that is driving itself, basically. <laughs> We're not technically driving itself. You still turn and blah 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 stuff like that. But there's safety measures and engage. <laughs> I'm going in safety mode. <laughs> Hell yeah. Who's riding with Priska I... in safety mode? Is it Otto, or I... is it Piper, or is it Kiwi? I only know how to drive a car. This is not the same thing. <laughs> oh, look at you driving a car. Well, yeah, don't you have a license? I know, I'm being... I, <laughs> I don't have a license anymore. I left that, uh... Anyway. <laughs> you can have fun with Kiwi, you know? <laughs> <laughs> this conversation got awkward. <laughs> Priska, as you get in, uh, you just feel you just feel someone getting in behind you. <laughs> Look, okay, sir. it's our helmet. Let's see. <laughs> you see Kiwi just looking down at you as you look behind. <laughs> well, think you can manage the ride without telling me. Oh, wait, we already did the name thing. Uh, shit. Hold up, my memory just remembered we realized he didn't have the name and the, yeah. Okay, anyway. Got it, boy. Blech. Hmm. Think you can handle a ride with me? I might reveal your backstory. And there really isn't anything to reveal. That's for me to decide and you to spell out. If you need me to spell it out, how are you going to reveal it? I didn't think this through. Okay, I'm tired. <laughs> I just woke up. We would use logic. It was super. My effective. mouth tastes like sweat. <laughs> All right, Otto and Otto and Piper. Who's driving? <laughs> On one Auto. hand, Pepper is like saying, so you're like, I have slightly more experience than Zero, but also Otto did this for a living, so he can take care of it. It's fine. Otto will try. You okay. literally did this for a living! What do you mean, did this for a living? What do you mean? That's me to you! <laughs> I didn't do this for a living. I'm I... confusing a different person? Yeah, I got Yeah. Were you walking around? Dude, I'm I, sorry. <laughs> I was walking around because I was poor. I'm telling you, know, was... you, Emerald, what the fuck is going <laughs> What? What do you mean? What's wrong? What's I'm, up? Just, I'm just thinking, like, you're role-playing. It's like, I am not saying any of this in character. I'm talking to you. What? Uh? I'm so confused. Oh, okay, all right. This is, you know what? Let's not talk about it anymore. I'm good. I don't even want to know anymore. <laughs> This conversation has gotten too awkward. I'm leaving. <laughs> so Otto's gonna drive. Otto's <laughs> gonna drive. Yeah. Yeah. Let's Let's do it. I got I got Otto and Street confused for a second. It's the point I'm trying to say there. <laughs> okay. 
You uh, see, I was the one that did, you know, the crime thing where I was taking packages to places. You know, the, the, the bad deck. I'm not the street boy. You only know how to drive a truck. <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll let you guys out. Press button. I don't know why I said that as I pressed it. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> this party's breaking apart. <laughs> As you guys would turn to go uh, to go out, uh, Otto, um, there is uh, there you know you know it's 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 uh it's, it's, you know you you're doing good you're you're doing you're doing mm-hmm. well. Uh, I'd like you to go ahead and uh, as you are going to leave in said dual runner, uh, go ahead just just go ahead and give me an instinct roll. I have plus one to that now. You did it. That egg was ripped. That's a thirteen. 13. You're doing okay. Oh, yeah, I'll put that back over for help. You're, 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 doing, you're doing all right. You, you're able, you were able to do your first turn. Um, yeah. <laughs> He's doing it. As you guys go out, uh, you guys are able to get onto the uh, uh, the bridge that lowers itself, getting out onto the other side. And then uh, you guys start heading out uh, from there. Uh, Otto, you are going uh, decently slow, I'm guessing. Or are you like, what, what's going down with you? <laughs> He'll try to keep pace with with Friska. You were about to fuck up. <laughs> you were this close. Go ahead and go ahead and give me another instinct roll then. <clears throat> Let's do it. This is great. This is fine. It's gonna be fine, guys. I swear, it's gonna be fine. Everything will be fine. Just so another twelve. It's another thirteen. Another 13. Uh, roll me for your finesse. Oh hey, the th- I'm really good at that. Yeah, you're good at that. Yeah. And you have uh you have a fleeting. I have a fleeting for this? Cool, because that nine was not great. So nine plus three, uh, that's twelve. I don't know, you shit, Benkin. You're right, though. I'll let, I'll, I'll let that happen. Uh, that, is a, <laughs> that is a twelve, or you said nine plus three is twelve? Where's the nine Ye- from? Isn't that not yeah, a... The first roll was, oh, first first roll was a nine. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Yeah, got yeah, got yeah, got yeah, got yeah. Got it. I understand. <laughs> All right, got nine, it. three. 12. So, I'm just getting 12s and 13s for this. I don't know if that's good or bad. You're yeah, able, to, you're you're able to somewhat go well. Uh, Prisca, you know that uh, you know that um, uh, whenever you guys start going, uh, that uh, Gear says that they will they will try to keep up uh, keep up with uh, with Otto and Prisca. However, they are going extremely fucking slow compared to you guys. But he's not crashed yet, so that's good. As you guys are are driving, uh, you do hear um, uh, you do hear Prisca from uh, from Gear. So, what is the story about what you were mentioning before? Well, that's not for me to determine. Is it not? How about how about you tell us tell us about yourself? Like what? You know. How you grew up, where you came from, who taught you the blade, is your mentor cool, are they teaching? So, uh, Prisca, why don't you roll me for your, uh, <laughs> why, don't, why don't you, why don't you give me, uh, why don't you give me an instinct roll right there? <laughs> oh god, girl, what do you do? <laughs> I don't know what I did, but I'm hoping for one. Let's go! I can't believe he's gonna cut a bike while on it. <laughs> yeah, get ready for this. I can't believe you girl boss oh, to ten. Uh, roll me one more time I for don't... Saladin. Yeah, I don't know why this is a ten, but it's a ten. Hover over, you'll see. I I saw it. It should be yeah, a two, but I, it is I... a ten. That's a C Evan, okay. As you as you mention uh who taught you the blade, uh in those specific words, because that, that was a pretty good one. Um <laughs> You do you do feel that there is a there is a sudden tensing up behind you as you whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, as uh, as as there is there is a there is um not not the not the the greatest the greatest because again you guys are you guys are riding together obviously like there has to be some like connection between the two of you uh you do feel that he tenses up rather rather harshly as soon as you mention that okay um. Sorry, didn't mean to. Oof. No, uh, nothing. Evil mentor. Got it. What? Nothing. Mm. Uh, so, what are your hobbies? I think we're done. <laughs> Fair enough. 
Gears, play Despacito. <laughs> I don't get it. You got the answer you wanted, did you not? How come you were not pressing against it? I I think I got too deep with by accident. Is it because you're showing uh, increased heart rate, thinking that you were afraid? <laughs> hey, there are other reasons my heart rate's going fast. <laughs> Is it because you were on a bike for the first time? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's oh, it, that's it, it. increased again. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, girl. <laughs> but I guess I'll have a silent ride. My mission was a failure. I do not understand, but okay. As you uh, you guys continue going, uh, and again, Otto, you are you are able to you're able to keep up uh, in a in decent form. Uh, whenever you guys mm -hmm. start getting into the actual like city streets, however, it starts getting a little bit tougher. Uh, I would like you to roll me uh, one more finesse check, please. Okay, guys, here I go, another finesse. You can do it. Uh... Man, if I were more confident in myself, I would use a trick here, but, you know, that's probably not a good idea. Alrighty, let's do so this. If we die, we die. Just go with you. If, if we, we die, die, we die. die. <laughs> if we die, we die. That's it's why it's called ride or die. Another 20. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm, under, I'm only rolling 12s and 13s. This one's more, this one's more uh, ride and die, you know? Uh, one more time, one more time. Oh from Van, so, thank you very much, Van. So 12, 16, there we go. That's a 17 altogether. Okay, a 17 altogether. Is it, uh, wait, is it finesse? I said or finesse, instinct? my dude. Oh, then that's 19. <laughs> I was like, wait a fucking minute. Uh, wait a damn minute. You are able to make your to make your, your way through as you guys are, are going in here. Uh, you do note that once you guys pull into the area just outside of the, uh, just outside of the apartment complex, uh, you do get some looks as you guys roll up in dual runners. Uh, you know, the things that, that people uh, usually get arrested for having. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> We're criminals now. <laughs> uh, but as you guys get here, uh, Kiwi just sort of immediately jumps off and goes over to his corner outside of the, outside of the, the area. Uh, he seems to have rushed out there, basically, as soon as, as soon as you guys even almost pulled in. He just jumped off. Getting away from Prisca, probably. Who knows? <laughs> but uh, you guys, you guys slow down and, and you stop in front of it. Yeah, oh, yeah. Otto and Piper, you got, you got, you guys can handle it. You did it. You you lived. <laughs> we lived. We didn't die. We didn't die. We did it. I did it. <laughs> Somehow Otto did not fuck it up. It's been didded. It's been done, did it, did Do you get off as well, Prisca? William Dorf? William! Sorry, I was kind of coughing there. No, that's fine. Do you get off as well? Uh, yeah. Okay. As the three of you get off of the, get off the bikes, uh, you again just see people, like, staring over, looking over toward the bikes, looking over towards you. You see Kiwi just sort of standing at the bikes as if he's like, no, no, I, I got this. <laughs> Thank you. He got this. People look over toward bikes, sees man with sword. <laughs> All right. Have a nice day. Understood. <laughs> Understood. Have a nice day. <laughs> but no. Um, as you guys go to head inside. Yeah. Do. Upon going inside, we are going to uh, quickly uh, go to a to another to another little thing that needs to that needs to be done before we go further into this. Uh, around two hours ago, that was a long time ago. Uh, we, damn. we got forty dollars uh, from uh, Zero Lavender, who said, "Have some dual points to fuel your card opening addictions." It wasn't immediately Heck like yeah. like like important to the plot or like important to any any roles mm -hmm. or anything at the time, so I didn't I didn't go into it immediately. But that is going to be twenty thousand dual points which is divided between four of you. So that's going to be 5,000 dual points for everybody. Hell yeah. Hell, Hell yeah. yeah. Thank you, Zero. Thank, Thank you, Zero. 
That's gonna turn uh it's gonna Hell turn yeah. auto into a thirty one thousand. Yeah. That's gonna turn uh Riku into a eighteen thousand. Heck yeah. That's gonna turn Piper into a twenty seven thousand. Economy. And it's gonna turn Preska into a twenty-eight thousand. You can tell who spends the most money. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> I do all the fucking work here. <laughs> but yes, thank you very much, Zero. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. I didn't want to interrupt everything that was going on, so that's why I didn't mention mm -hmm. it immediately. But uh, in between that, Riku, you said you wanted to change. Uh, yeah. I would be I would be a miss without without letting you know that obviously she let you leave. <laughs> mm -hmm. Nothing nothing really happened there. Uh, Ninja Boy is just basically following after you every time. Mm -hmm. But as you go over to the to the opposite side and you go to open your door, which is now shut, because <laughs> you never went over there to shut it, but it is now shut. You you yeah. you stand you you open it up. You look inside uh, as you see on the ground in front of you, Riku. There is a, there is, there is a person. There is a person there. As you look onto, onto the ground in front of you, you see what appears to be, uh, a, a, uh, a, a familiar, a familiar looking, uh, looking, uh, looking young lady. As she looks to you, <laughs> as she looks up to you, you see, as she goes like, nyan, 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 nyan. You can almost hear the words. Welcome home, master. Do you want dinner or a bath or me? You see, Rika just stop, <laughs> drop, and kill. <laughs> well, I've already had dinner and I seem to have already taken a bath, so I guess I'm picking you. Oh shit! Yeah. <laughs> you make your way in. You see that Ninja Boy is looking between the two of you. She looks up towards you, stars in her um, eyes. And then I give a bath on the head. Okay, you can cut that out. She disappears. <laughs> <laughs> she dies. <laughs> she goes. <"Nack." laughs> But if you want to play on an e role play version of this, <laughs> you can get your get solutions maps or immersive e role. Yeah, we're not talking about that to anyone. You got that? Looks at Ninja Boy. Ninja like looks down at the floor, looks back to you, down the floor, back to you, puts both hands up. <laughs> Good. Who is the hostage and who is the... <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, yeah, just getting changed. That's it. Where are you going? Yeah, bedroom. We'll move yourself over. Okay. You make your yeah. way over into your bedroom, uh, <laughs> as you do. <laughs> do, do, do. You find that you're not the only person in the bedroom. Is my dog just unlocked? <laughs> you make your way in as you do. You see that there is a that there is a person sleeping in your bedroom. Hey. 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 You say hey, hey, hey. Hey. Yep. Nothing. She doesn't seem to be waking up. Just shake. As you go to shake, you find you you put your hand down uh, as if you are going to to shake. You find that a kunai makes its way and embeds itself into the uh, into the um uh, the uh, headrest of your bed. <laughs> Dude, behave. 
<laughs> you see him narrowing me, his eyes at you. <laughs> let me shake this woman while she's unconscious. He's like, I don't know, it's gonna sus as fuck though. Uh, she is in my house. I'm just trying to wake her up. That's what they all say. You see him look <laughs> to is- you. You see, you, you bring up a good point. His eyes are still narrowed, however, as he steps back and disappears into the darkness. This I mean, you could wake house. her up if you don't trust me. Okay, okay you're gone. gone. <laughs> this is my house. I own her. <laughs> Damn. How many property women are property? <laughs> we, we could and just we'll ride size. back. Sees if he can find the old alarm and sets it for one minute. You 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 pick up your alarm and you set it, you set it for one minute. Yeah, right next to her head as well. You leave it down. I'm guessing you grab some clothes. Yeah. You grab some clothes. You head out. Head over toward the head over towards your towards your bathroom. As soon as you get in there, a couple of seconds go by before you hear the alarm go off and then you hear a yell from the other room. <laughs> there we go. As you get yourself, you get yourself ready. Eventually, you hear the alarm go off. Uh, before, uh, before you, uh, you, you dress yourself. You, uh, you, you like clean yourself off with satellite water. So basically, you just re dirty mm-hmm. yourself. Who knows? I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, good point. Good point. <laughs> no, no, good point. <laughs> Uh, as you as you come out, uh, you see that uh, upon going into your main room, there's just a person sitting there. <laughs> Do you just Nothing. live here now? What? Do you just live here now? No. Why? Why would I? No. Of course not. Why? What? Uh, so why did you stay in my bed? It was either this place or the garbage room. Fair point, but oh, that's not a point. Solid point, solid point. <laughs> what, you wanted me to stay at you wanted me to stay at the garage area? There wasn't any anywhere that I could see I could stay. Everybody was messing with cars and it was loud. This is just my life. <laughs> One second. You could have just woke me up. You could have just said something. You're right. I'm sorry. I I should have said something, like "Hey," or something, right? Well, thank you for saying that. Then I forgive you. <laughs> Life is hellish for you, brother. <laughs> Looks for the spare key. Find spare key. The 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 here. <laughs> well, like I said, I'm not staying here or anything. I only stayed here because you weren't here. So as long yeah. as I'm staying here, you don't stay here. And whenever I'm not staying here, you can stay here. No, no, no. We're not playing this game. Or not? <laughs> Trying to treat the room like it's child custody. <laughs> If you want to stay here, you can stay here. If I want to stay here, I'm gonna stay here. I think it's reasonable that we could share. It's my house. Well, yeah, but my but apartment. you also kidnapped me. No, that was your ninja friend. I don't... I, he's not my friend. He's your friend or something. Some kind of cosplayer guy. You, you, you did all this. I did not. You did I this. did nothing. <laughs> I have literally done nothing. She just sort of like uh, she just sort of like Well, it's not appropriate. So we'll figure something else out then. I mean you could stay in the room and I'll just stay in the couch. We'll figure something out. Are you sure you can't stay in the garbage room? That... <laughs> That's not my room. I'm surprised it's anyone's room. I'm going to be honest. There was a big rat whenever I looked last time. Ignore the rat. It doesn't exist. But it, I saw it. If anyone mentions the rat, just ignore it. It literally bit down on us. It, meant... it literally bit if down on Prescott... like a scrap of a toaster or something and bent it. If Prescott specifically talks about the giant rat, you say nothing. It does not exist. Um. 
Now what does it exist? Uh, (laughs) The giant rat doesn't exist? Exactly. I'm glad we solved that problem. I Thank I don't you, think it you. I don't think it's solved at all. <laughs> it's solved. Mm-hmm. Anyway, here's the spare key to the apartment. And I'm getting breakfast. You want some? No, I can do things on my own. I've learned about this place I can go to today to get a lot of information. So that's where I'm going to be heading Ooh. off to. I'm sorry, where? Well, whenever I was making my way home the other day, uh, there was a nice man in front of in front of the apartment who said that if I was looking for anything, that I could make my way over toward the south of the city, and I could ask some people that are around there. Apparently, that's a really good information spot. So once I get the information I need out of them, I'll be able to find my deck. So, Dika, how dangerous is from that is how dangerous is that from Riku's memory? I mean, depending on how south they're talking. Um... If we go like like down to the south south, then that was that's around mm-hmm. where you know kind of harborman territory. But also there are there are people who live there. Mm-hmm. Um, but again, mostly mostly harborman territory. If they're talking about just the south from here, we get into like the mid area of town, which is entirely crawler territory. Um, yeah. So there is there, there is a there's a high chance that either that either one uh would would have uh would have uh, access to gang activity um you know but uh, who knows man maybe 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 she got some good intel who's who's to say so remember <laughs> what happened to your information last time she does not respond <laughs> so sano sano listen to me what do you want me to say? If you go, we can work together on this. Mm-hmm. You're already staying in my apartment. If I find somewhere else, I won't have to. I just don't think that it's good for me to set up a permanent residence because I'm not going to be staying here very often. That's fair enough. And I respect that. But we should just work together, get your deck back, and then everyone goes on their merry way. Mm-hmm. And fine, if you want to stay in this place without me being there, I won't be here. Sometimes. Mm-hmm. And all I have to do is let you come with me? Yep. Fine. Thank you. Because otherwise, if you get kidnapped, imagine the amount of arms I have to break. What, if that cosplayer guy, like you said, is my friend, then he'll be there or whatever, right? I'll be fine. I mean, he loses focus easily, apparently. Mm -hmm. Again, I don't know anything about them, so you saying that they... They just look like... Never mind. They look like the card, don't they? A bit. I can't. Re- I don't really have the card to compare it right now, but a bit. Uh, you you know who does have the card to compare him? A friend. Come with me. Come with me. <laughs> she also has a working toaster. It's nice. The, the, the... Yeah. Why don't you have any appliances? This is this is. Oh right, your your kitchen was destroyed. Would you like to pay rent? Exactly. Anyway, <laughs> I could. <laughs> okay, when I'm not staying here, you're paying rent. Hmm. I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, I'm kidding. <laughs> you see, just Rika do a fist pump, like yes. <laughs> I'm kidding. Yes, I told her I kidded. I'm playing. I'm playing. <laughs> reverse, reverse psychology, baby. Yes, I lied to her. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. Good job, Riku, my <laughs> loyal servant. We'll get you your kitchen yet. <laughs> As you make your way back across the back across the hall, uh, it's around it's around the time that uh, whenever you you start heading back, that down the hall. 
you would see that uh, there were some people making their making their way inside. Prisca, Piper, Otto, you guys look down the hall and you guys see what appears to be uh, what appears to be uh, Riku as well as as well as Sana. Wait, you've become the kidnapper? <laughs> Piper said you were kidnapped, Riku, and we're here to save you. Yeah, so they weren't like holding your life for like this weird painting. All right. No. Wait, what? <laughs> you guessed? Uh <laughs> Listen, Prisca, is it wrong for me to guess? To get like a solid, like just a random chance of the things that have happened in like the last week and tell me it was not an appropriate guess? Fair enough. To be fair, it was an appropriate right. guess. That's right. Yeah, anyway. anyway. <sighs> let's, let's like, just get this can, we ex can we exchange the painting like it's an evil deal or something? I like those in movies. <laughs> you know what, Cher? Sure, do whatever you want. I'm gonna have some more toast. I'm just gonna eat all <laughs> the toast. This toast. Do not even know. Fucking stop me. <laughs> I'm gonna okay. eat all this toast. Okay, first we gotta look at look around suspiciously, making sure no one Is that right? <laughs> Looks to everyone. Nope, yeah. don't see anything. Yeah, I don't see nope. anything right now. Uh I could probably be around here, but you know. <laughs> uh right. Yeah, nothing. <laughs> So let's head in. <laughs> I I I don't know what kind of weird power play is going on, but something's <laughs> street sweat give me hallucinogenic. Problems. No, no, this is all real, Prisca. Give me You guys all start making your way into the the house opposite of of Riku's. As you do, you see that uh, sitting off to the sitting off to the uh, the opposite side. There appears to be a, a woman in a in a in a chair as she immediately spins around in the chair, looking back at all of you, holding on to a cane in front of her. Well, well, well. I well, think that you're here to you. I see that you're here to negotiate. Cash first. <laughs> Wait, no, sorry. Hold on. <laughs> Oh, wait. Abuse. Okay. Cash first. <laughs> That's not how we do things here, Prisca. Though I do enjoy that you are prepared to make a deal. <laughs> Show me the goods. Kinda does a motion to Piper, like, <laughs> <laughs> Well, those Man. goods are rather nice, but I'm looking for a painting. <laughs> This, this movie oh, genre is very I'm just gonna not. Get out the way. I swear. <laughs> I, I, this here. movie genre is really not my forte. <laughs> it would have been better if I brought sunglasses. As soon as you bring it out, you do see that they just kind of hop up again. They they kind of kick the side of the cane up, do a spin and do a spin, and then keep it underneath their arm as they're walking forward. Well, well, well! You did bring it back to me. Hey, bring it back. Well, I stole it fair and square, didn't I? I even left a calling card and everything. But no, you didn't even want to look into it. That's no fun. It's no fun at all. But, but you stole it. But she, she's the art. Is this out of In a way, didn't she outsmart you by taking it back under your nose without, you know? following up on the calling card? Oh, of course. They completely outsmarted me by taking it out of my room that I left unlocked and opened and left it out in the middle of nowhere. I definitely didn't want you to do that. Shrug. Oh. I guess she's what you call those sundares. <laughs> Is that way, what they call it? I'm here to make a deal for that little piece of art you have there. And I think you already know my terms. I'm gonna be honest with you. I was called by Riku while I was half asleep. I kind of forgot half of them. I'm sorry. I heard you had a. Yeah. I heard you had a toaster. 
<laughs> this way, this way. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Yes, make yourselves at home. Eat the toast. <laughs> Do you want some orange juice as well? You're lucky I have orange juice. I'm like... <laughs> As Riku makes their way, uh, makes their way in there, you just see that uh, that Thrill Seeker begins to uh, she begins to start like crediting around, like 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 sharks in water. As it gets yeah, over keep... toward Priska, looks over to Priska, gives a smirk, and then like does a uh, does a a light poke uh, forward with the um, uh, with the uh, the whole with the holding end of the cane. Hmm. Gets around behind Piper, looks over toward Otto, who's off in the corner. As uh, as uh, as she does, she brings the cane again once out and like kind of taps it down onto his onto his shoulder. I see you brought your muscle. As intimidating as he is, I don't think that he'll gift you any deals. You By underestimate way, me. I was accidentally on mute, but when she put the cane to Prisca, she started breath breathing kind of heavy a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> but not out of fear. And out of lesbianism. <laughs> As she says that to Otto, she moves around and then looks to, and looks to Piper in the painting. And at last, we finally meet. Although it appears that one of us knows more about the other. While you may have my face, I hmm, have been looking into you, Miss Piper. Mm-hmm. What I see there is obviously something that should not exist in this world. And as such, it makes it very valuable to somebody like me. Mm, I must not, not exist in this world? Mm-hmm. What you've if depicted people there, freak out when they look at it. What you've depicted there are what appears to be the tendrils between the worlds, are they not? Otherwise known as, well, arms of the shadows, the uh, palms of perpetual darkness, the fingers for the fingerless. The shadow hands, yeah. <laughs> oh god, they're real? Well, it's just a painting. <laughs> <laughs> Look, there's a lot going on, and there's a lot of stuff that could be nonfiction. But I mean, I mean, it, this thing grabbed me. So, oh god, they're real! <laughs> you were there. Oh yeah, I was. Okay. <laughs> What I want from that is I want to take this to a certain buyer that I think will do something rather neat with it. As well as do something rather neat with me. I can get a rather hefty reward from something like that. And, in turn, I'll help you find this other thief of yours. As you know, I'm pretty alright in that subject. What do you mean, another thief? Hmm. Sano's deck. You just hit from the corner. <laughs> oh, all right. I've been told been... by my intelligence group that you're looking for another thief going around here. Stealing cards, was it? I'm glad that Prisk is tired, because I can use that as an excuse. <laughs> <laughs> it's been the cards, long, yeah. <laughs> that has been... That's definitely just been missing for a while well you have the aid of the great the great successor to the phantom thief right here in front of you if there's a thief out there doing something that i can't do anything for then you're out of luck no matter what but i am the greatest thief in the lands if i can find them for you give you the information get you back what was stolen i think that'd be worth that painting don't you think and whatever rewards I would get from it. You're really getting top dollar for this, aren't you? <laughs> Let's just say my I buyer mean... likes getting some strange things such as that for his little project of his. 
something about stitching back what was lost. I think something like that would be very up his alley. And if you're planning on making more paintings like that, I can provide you with materials. Hey, look at that, Piper. Yeah, there's plenty of power to go around here. Where mm -hmm. can your career go I. <laughs> it's always much just easier to work artist. with the artist than to just steal from the artist, after all. I don't like taking from those who are less fortunate. I like taking from those that have large security measures. Although, to be fair, that rat was rather elusive. Okay, so there is a rat. <laughs> it doesn't exist. <laughs> I'm gay. You make signals on this? <laughs> She's lying. <laughs> We're gonna fucking kill you. <laughs> so what do you say? Instead of me having to take these from you, we could make a deal. We could even shake on it. I um, do like the idea of shaking on it. <laughs> I'm already helping you out enough a little bit, aren't I? Apparently. Or don't she you recognize like... me, Piper? Uh, yeah, yeah I... <laughs> she just pulls out the card. <laughs> <laughs> It seems that you do recognize me. They're you're, still you're, trying you're, to like play it up like they're super hard. <laughs> well, you're pretty hard to forget. <laughs> Very nice choice of words. I'm working on this. Okay, sorry, I, I got like eight hours to sleep and that somehow wasn't enough. But yeah, it just opens, it just goes open and open a hand. There's something different about you than last time. Mm -hmm. Feels like you're finally starting to get it. <laughs> maybe, get it won't what? maybe it won't take as long as I thought. What? She puts her hand out towards you. Yeah, all right. Handshake. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. More cryptic shit. I don't fucking... <laughs> <laughs> As you go to shake hands, she do you do feel that she pulls you a little bit closer to um, uh, closer to you, uh, as she does. We both have our secrets, don't we, Piper? Mm. Some that obviously need to stick to the darkness, but others that are rather thrilling. Mm. Don't worry. I'm sure you'll figure out which ones are which. And if you need help, she lets go of you. I'm right here. We have a agreement now, don't we? You with me. I'm assuming this painting is yours. So I'm stepping on it. There you go. <laughs> she takes the painting. The successor to the great gentleman thief. The phantom of the, the, phantom of the outer worlds. Does not go back on her word. You see her raise her hand behind her. Riku! Yes. <laughs> place, it, place this in my trove. I just leave one gang to go to another. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Riku's just like, what's she like? He's still like buttering toast. <laughs> Like one toast in the hand, and he's like, "Well, fuck he it. literally just goes over, picks up the painting, and then goes into the room directly beside of where she was." <laughs> now let's uh, find keeping your the thief. toaster now. <laughs> Technically, it's not really a gang; it's more of a crew. Because when it comes to like thieving stuff, it's like it's you're with your crew, you're with your, your crew. Also, it's not really a gang. I I don't want this to become a thing. You know she knocked me out with a cane, right? I thought you would. Sorry. I honestly thought you would dodge. <laughs> Did you dodge? I said I wasn't in a great mood. Come on. Now, while I'm looking for this thief of yours, it might take a little bit of time. You're probably going to get contacted pretty soon, though. You're a fam dealer. Most likely. Though, I don't really see the need to ever go make my way to the south. I don't much like it down there. 
Oh, I need I to touch the that. sand peeler anyway. <clears throat> what was that, Piper? I keep hearing that. It's just not a very good place, is it? <laughs> Why? Hmm? Oh, it, uh... Well... You see her twist around. She brings the uh, she brings the the cane up to her mouth for a minute before just like kind of like poking it back and forth, like thinking about what how to, like how to say things. Mm. It brings back unfortunate ties for some of us. Hmm. You must be wondering how you're even talking to me right now, right? With my mouth and ears. Your mouth and ears rather are rather well enough for talking, I suppose. I was more meaning... Well. How much do you know about my kind? Oh, yeah, I guess... Listen, we, we guess know... Wouldn't. We know intimately your kind. Mm-hmm. <laughs> intimately? <laughs> Just how intimately do you feel you know us? Um... Yeah. Autumn, this is strange, isn't it? You're starting to piece it together, aren't you, Prisca? Yeah, because mm. someone like Apollo, he was only able to appear in Abby's room. I was starting to like carry of it anyway. <laughs> There are certain places around the city that are very good for people, spirits that come from all of you, that's true. Ones where they can finally show themselves or do some sort of effect on things. And sometimes they can even attach themselves to one of you and try to haunt you, as I'm sure that you've all figured out by now as well, with what I saw of the moon the other night. Yeah, I was not part of that. <laughs> Talk about it, so just like what? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean, Moon? <laughs> I wouldn't worry too much about it. But there are certain circumstances that allow card spirits, like what you guys seem to have with you, to bring themselves out and perform certain tasks for you. But they're not entirely like me. I can maneuver my way around this place freely. I can go anywhere here in the satellite. Hell, I can even go into New Domino. I've done it several times. You see her eye, what appears to be a um, uh, a uh, glass like um, uh, like a glass like little little domed uh, structure over in the corner of the room that has the same jewel that she's holding in her hand right now. Nice. <laughs> so like, so I've even that... been to Neo Domino a couple of times. So I mean, that means. Looks... <laughs> I was gonna go say ahead. it looks like it's it looks like you've been to Crash Town too. <laughs> <laughs> I've been all over and I will continue to go all over it's the same thing with a couple of others that you've met so far you guys were mentioning the keeper as well yeah he makes his way to Neo Domino all the time though it's a lot easier for some of us to remain here than others it's more homey I suppose that's the kind of best way I can put it. But someone like him can stay a lot closer to the south than someone like me. Again, it brings up old ties that we'd rather leave buried. There are things that keep me from feeling as free as I do. And I'd rather them not get pulled up again. Hmm. I'm not sure about any other people like myself. As you said, Piper, you said you've heard this before. But we all have our reasons for not wanting to dredge up old memories. The satellite is an interesting place for a lot of us. Some of us come out not really knowing much about ourselves, where we came from, just bits and pieces. While others... Learn over time exactly why we are better off alone. So what about all of you? What exactly have you been doing for your spirits? 
other than she eyes Riku, well, it's something rather naughty. I plead the fifth. Brisket kind of looks down. Well, I kind of wish I could do more. One of the last things I did for my spirit. She starts thinking as Zara the Ment and starts trembling. I've been meaning to have a moment when and thoughts who is covered to talk to him. Hmm. Mm. I say, owe him a lot. I say keeping them in mind is going to do you all very good. From what I know, you are all about to be informed of something that you've been looking into. At least that's from what my information sources have been able to gather. Whenever you learn of it, I think you'll meet something that. You probably already met something similar to it, but again, I and Riku, there are other ways to go about it. You'll find out soon, I'm sure. Hmm. There are others, many different types of spirits, some of them more lost than others. If you don't want your spirits to end up that way, take care of them. And like I said, if you find something like me, one that has a reason for not wanting to go certain places, I would say unless you're willing to go the extra mile, unless you're willing to put yourself on the line, don't try to fix them. As she leans over on her cane. There's no use in half-assing something if you're not in it for the long haul. Hmm. Hmm. Something I can agree on. Of course. As Briska was looking down and does look a bit more determined as she looks back up. As you guys look forward after getting that. Hello? Testing, testing. He found us. There we go. I knew you were going get to inter- get interacted with soon. I'll be over here. <laughs> uh, there's something I want to ask you, actually, later. Ask me? No, he was talking no, to me. No, not you. She was talking to me. Uh, f- <laughs> if I'm dealing with- did this guy sound like a strange request? Can you add one more person to this call? <laughs> I, find it, I find it hard to believe that if the person you're asking is around, that, uh, well, they can't already hear me. Right. <laughs> Unless you're trying to add the other one around you to it? Yeah, that one. <laughs> Three, two, one. Oh, it did work. Ah! <laughs> Hello, Phantom Dealer. Hey, uh, Phantom so Death, well. the spirits. <laughs> welcome to this crazy world. Yes, yes, welcome, welcome. I have things to say, though. Don't try, because uh, the last time I mentioned these things, you uh, really went over me a lot, and I couldn't tell you the exact terminology and everything that was ready. But this time there is a bit more time, so we have, we have plenty of time to go over everything that you wanted me to look up. We have found what you wanted to find, by the way. Mm-hmm. You were all wanting to find one of the two other areas that you were looking into, correct? Either the forest or the underground? Correct. Yes. We were able to find them both. <laughs> the forest is from what we have learned through any sort of scouting, is far more dangerous. However, once we found the forest, it was uh, a little bit difficult, and I do want to bring something up with you that I feel you might be upset about. And I just want you to know that I did everything in my power. Okay. Mm-hmm. Fine, we won't shoot the messenger. Uh, your... Hmm. 
Do I have to be the one? To, can can you just come here and figure it out? Do I have to say it now? Fan, you'll just he'll, say it. Yeah, I think it'll probably be worse if you have to see it. You, mm -hmm. when we open the gate to the forest to scout everything out, your birds decided to rush in, mostly all at once. Ye yeah, mm -hmm. that makes sense. Is that a bad thing? Because we didn't want to go there. Uh, I, I tried to see if I could get them to come back after doing a little bit of scouting, like I said, but they just would not return. I, I don't know what else to say. I did my absolute best. I, what am I supposed to wrangle every single one of them? I can't do that. They didn't seem to like it down here very much. Ultimately, it's their own fault for not sticking around. Well, well, <laughs> we it, seems, it seems the birds flew the coop. Yes. Anyway, uh, <laughs> about thank you. We not make it seem like like they probably had good reason. I'll I'll talk to them. Well, if you want to talk to them, you'll have to wait a little bit. Uh, the forest the forest entrance does only opens in the morning, similar to the uh, entrance into the netherworld. However, uh, what I wanted to tell you because that is the one you wanted to know the most of the underground entrance was something that we figured out has several opening points throughout the day. Not only can you make your way there in the mornings, but you can also make your way there at night. Hmm. Interesting. I wonder why that's the case. It appears that different uh, shattered worlds have different times and different points in which they can open up, depending on how open they themselves are. The netherworld, it seems as if, was very closed off, and because of that, the forest which is connected to it, seems very closed off as well, as if there are people who are keeping their secrets, or maybe it's to do with whoever is in charge of that area. But the one who's in charge of the underground seems very much more openly uh, aggressive with things. Mm. The last thing I'll mention is I think we found Hextrude as well. Is she in her own, or is she in one of the two of them? It seems to be in a very small, uh, shattered world that is off to somewhat of a, uh, side passage from it, if it wasn't for myself being able to be as, as, uh, resilient and as, 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 well, honestly, as talented Cowboy. as I am. Uh, how did talented? Let's go with talented. If it wasn't for me being as talented as I was, I would not have been able to make it through. They appear to be inside of a rather large manor or 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 or, uh, or a uh, um, chateau, a very large uh, golden castle or something. I wouldn't say golden, but a castle would be fitting it. Uh, it was hard enough uh, from what I could see, mm. but it, it it seemed as if there were. <clears throat> quite the number of um, other presences around. I didn't stick too far around to find out much. Hmm. But with that being said, there are uh, more openings than I think we could uh, exploit when it comes to that place. Whenever you had opened up the area off in the netherworld, it seems that it had weakened the structure of most of the smaller uh, grottos that we are now calling them. Uh, once you are able to maybe attain a great power or you know, ally yourselves with something in these worlds, perhaps these grottos will have more weaknesses uh, come with them. The side passage, mm -hmm. unfortunately, only opens once a week into the home of Hextrude. That's a problem for if you want to make your way back. That means you'll only be able to go out of there once a week as well. Uh, do we know? Mm, uh, well, was do we know that time is like particularly synced with the real world, or have we found it is basically one to one? Mm. Before well, the I... spirit world was much more its own place, but now that it is shattered and collecting itself around, uh, well, these worlds, they seem to be mostly one to one at this point. I believe mm -hmm. that that is one of the exploits that the uh, Crimson Dragon had used all that time ago was to exploit the time desync, but it seems things have definitely not been the same ever since that happened. 
Mm. Well, luckily for us, I guess she's lowest priority considering the birds and finding a replacement king. I can tell you that the presences that I felt from the underground were very strong. The one thing I can say about it is the one that is in charge there, I don't believe hails from there. Which means that there may or may not be one or two or maybe even more that are technically the ruler or king of that realm. That might be why there's so many entrances as well. Fantastic. Oh, you'll find this, you'll find this a little bit um, unfortunate whenever I mention it out loud. Uh, but again, if we're going to be just out in the open about everything. Uh, one of the presences felt strangely familiar to what I felt whenever you all, uh, in particular Prisca and Piper, whenever I was in the real world with all of you and that shadow game had occurred. Whatever this presence is, it seems to be on the same sort of feeling as Hextrude was at that time. I don't exactly know what it means, I'm going to be honest with you. It does seem similar enough, however. Hmm, that's worrying. A wicked? No, no, no. Believe me, I know what that feels like. Hmm. It seems different in some way. Again, more closer to whatever was giving power hmm. or drawing power into that of Hextrude. I don't know anything else about it, as Riku seems to think my cowardice, I like to say talent, uh, does not allow me to go too far into these places without having to turn back. But that is the information that I have gathered for you. So we make our way in, scout the place out, find the treasure, leave behind, ex leave behind something to show that we were the ones being there, and then make our way out with the prophet. Do you, you say that like you're coming with us? You're well, I mean, coming I'm with always us. with you. That is true. All right. <laughs> right, 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 right. Uh, looks like we're going to a forest layer. Whichever one you want to make your way to, the forest does seem uh, more dangerous, but if you'd like to go there, we could definitely set something straight. Uh, mm. When it comes to the underground, uh, there is one other thing I wanted to mention. I wasn't the only one who returned from the underground. Oh. Oh? There is somebody here who would like to meet all of you. Apparently they have something they'd like to ask those who want to traverse the depths of this place. And he refuses to trust me for some reason or another. I don't know, maybe it's... I don't know. But probably your name. I fair. <laughs> but I've been nothing but helpful. You really the have. Thank you branch. very much. Ah, I can't go back. I can't go back on this. If I do, then I'll lose my power. I can't do that. There's a lot of power in a name, it. Riku. <laughs> mm -hmm. Either way. If you'd like to come and talk with them, uh, they apparently w represent one of the many different uh, clans that are inside of this underground, and they are looking to ask for aid, from what I can tell. Um, do we need to go immediately, or...? Well, if you plan on going to the, uh, to the underground at all today, you need to show up before so we can plan things out. Uh, I would say mm -hmm. midday at the latest, getting here, talking with them, and then preparing to set out if you want to help them. Uh, but if you're planning on going to the forest, then they'll probably be here until you make your way to the underground. I'm not sure exactly how much they can afford to enter back without any knowledge on how to return. Gotcha. It's just we have a tiny, tiny problem. Oh, I have Looks been told. Looks like dual disc. I have been told that uh, they will be returning as soon as the as soon as it opens again. So there's that. Okay. Gotcha. 
So we head back to the to the base, drop the thing down to the underground, and then we get to them. I mean, if <laughs> this is going to sound strange because it's coming from me, but I think we need some more tools for like flashlights since we're going underground or maybe some bags or rope. You mentioned bags, rope, tools. <laughs> you just see ste steps forward, pulls chair out, sits down, puts hands in front of them, interlocks fingies. <laughs> well, perhaps we can make a deal. It looks at everyone else. Am I making sense here? No, no, that you makes are. sense. Otherwise, yeah. I just had to keep summoning Shining Angel or him or yeah. one of my other monsters for light. Also, I felt like doing recycling today just to take a break, but apparently I can't catch a break. I'm sure if, anyway. you, wanted, I'm sure if you wanted to wait that any, any type of sane person would wait for their... Uh, would wait for their uh, saviors to do whatever they need to do. But if you want to take the quick route, I have an entire uh, an entire trove full of goodies that could possibly help you. Looks at everyone. What are you guys thinking? It would be easier just to get, the, get stuff where we need now than later. Yeah. <laughs> Oh god. Oh, <laughs> I, yeah, well, I was going to say something but I agree now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck whatever. Yeah, also your dual disc is that going to be fixed as well? Or... Was my dual disc broken? Yeah, I remember it being broken from that's last game. Hell, bro. <laughs> yeah. Oh uh, yeah, it is broken, huh? Yeah, that's why I was like, recycling, maybe you'll find another dual disc. <laughs> uh. I don't want to find just a new one. Just diamond hands like yours did. I don't yeah. want to find a new one, I want mine fixed. Yeah, that would take longer, probably. You know that uh, if you go back to the main area, that Street has an extra dual disc that he keeps inside of his area. He has a dedicated disc. Oh, that's fair. You'd have to ask him though. Okay. <laughs> yeah. It means he won't be coming with us. Unless he is, but he just won't be dueling, which is normal, I guess. I mean the last time he went, he was kind of tasted. He might not be extremely uh <laughs> The last time he went he was tasted and tributed himself. So You know what? That's fair. Let's just not mention anything about taste testing around Sano. <laughs> Why was there someone talking in my brain? <laughs> oh, that's fam dealer. We're helping to save the spirit. I, it's ridiculous every time I say it. No, you get more used to it the more you say it. Okay, so um, cards have spirits. The world is kind of screwed. We're helping out. We're the good guys. Thumbs up. Magic. <laughs> Uh, anyway, um... <laughs> she's just like staring at you guys, like, this is like, like, it's like, all right, pull the other one, uh, you know. It's like, come on, <laughs> where you're cucking cosplayers at? Let's fucking go. Anyway, um, <laughs> what do you guys as, know? Somebody cooking cosplayers from the satellite? As Sano is like trying to say something, you just see that uh, a shadow thief goes by. Before any of that, she makes her way into her trove. Uh, as Riku, you turn to like look and see what she's doing. She just slams the door. <laughs> Oh, I see how you treat your assistant. What am I saying? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you're getting into it. She seems to uh, be rustling around a lot in there. By the time uh, she returns, you see that she opens the door. She has a um, uh, she has a large bag in her hands, and she just tosses it over toward Otto. Ah, he catches it. <laughs> uh, you're the muscle, right? <laughs> um, the wrong person. I think Riku would fit that better. Well, Riku already has a role. Wait, what's my role? Well, 
have everybody has to have someone that's the most likely to turn on them, right? You're like the trusted Wait, I... you're like the trusted ally potential villain. Someone who whenever we go into whenever we go into the depths of this place is going to trip the wire, look back to us and take the gold. How could you, Riku? <laughs> So I cut out because my internet was dying. What? <laughs> <laughs> she said I that you are the wire. She said that you're you're more like the man who comes with, gets to the end, find we all uh, trips the wire from uh, and escapes with the gold. I feel hurt that I'm the traitor of the group, but it's also the role, understand. Riku. Come on. Anyway. <laughs> I feel like out of everyone, Riku wouldn't be like that at all. And neither are you. Look at your arms. You're not the muscle. <laughs> Come on, everyone. Get back into your parts. Rar. There you go. <laughs> he flexes a bit, but you know. There you go. <laughs> now, with all of that being said, she points over to Piper. You know when you know when you can use me to help you. I don't have to go anywhere near there. I'm not going to the south. However, if this if my tools do help you out at all, I'll be sure to know. And if they do help out, I will require another painting. Note taken. You'll find inside as many as many uh variations on scaling and checking technologies you can get. There's a flashlight, of course. That's what you guys wanted. You also find a couple of a couple of climbing spikes, a couple of harnesses, and uh, some different uh, lines of wire that you can use for rope. I don't have any actual rope. It doesn't look cool enough. True. Yeah, no, I, that makes sense. Yeah. But actual rope is safer. But again, it doesn't look cool <laughs> enough, Riku. Sometimes, sometimes they're really cool though. Super uh, safety. Riku, um, hold on. Uh, do you have your reading glasses? <laughs> Don't you start. I can throw you out the window. Think on it like this, Riku. <laughs> Whenever you're scaling the building, trying to escape the uh, trying to escape the bad guy, all of a sudden he pulls out a high-powered electromagnet, and then your wire gets gets pulled over to it, leading for an epic capture scene. If that situation happened, I'll make sure the person who was prepping all my items gave me a gun. <laughs> you know, in our with our luck, it would end up being a kissing scene instead of an epic action scene. Well, those what? can happen too. What? All I'm saying <laughs> is, if you want the, all I'm saying is, if you want the good tools, Riku, then try to master the basics first. Maybe then I can give you some sort of a grappling hook or or some sort of a, a, a stun gun or or some sort of other type of you maybe like a pin that launches a needle, you know. I would just like an actual gun. You're no fun. <laughs> she goes away. <laughs> <laughs> Rick is just saying, you're like, it all would have been so much easier if we were out of a gun just shot her. Why do people, why do women keep on saying I'm no fun? Because you're no fun. That's not something I would say out loud, Riku. <laughs> <laughs> I pled the fifth. Uh, let, let's get going. <laughs> what? How did you guys get here so fast, anyway? The bikes are done. I miss. Great. Cool. Cool. <laughs> cool. Yeah. I'm driving this time. Dibs. You guys want to make your way out? Yep. As you guys step out from where th uh, from where uh, Thrill Seeker uh, Thrill Seeker Shadow Thief is, she looks out um, uh, and again um, uh, gives a uh, gives a um, uh, look toward everybody before going. And Piper, huh? Oh, you just see as uh, as the the door is looking as if it is closing. You just see a smirk as the door shuts. She just sent a smirk at you as she as she called back to you. I was on mute. Prisca wanted to talk to her. <laughs> Prisca, you go back to the door. You open it up. They're gone. The end of a room. Shut her. <laughs> Darn. 
I guess she doesn't want my money. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. So yeah, now I gotta go take care of that. I thought that would work. <laughs> there are now... Go inside and say it louder, trust me. There are now five of us, but the bucket can only hold like two a person. Yeah. Yeah. Why, why am I She's getting gonna... counted among this? I mean, I just assumed you wanted to at least go back to the base and maybe go off from there. Mm. Yeah, you can and just I'll stay be... in the apartment. Honestly, I mean, you can do whatever you feel like. Well, what are you saying, Prisca? I'll be right back. <laughs> yeah, Prisca, you look around that you don't see her anywhere. You open up the you open up the trove as you do. They're not even there. Prisca's just standing there, just being, just repeating over like, "If only I could use my money." <laughs> <laughs> but no, what were you what were you yeah. saying, uh, Piper? I found your partner's bike. You you found you found Yama's bike. Mm-hmm. And I'm just it was strange. It was Norv not Norv the I'm not good with directions. Which one goes this way? He's gonna point like like northwest in her over hands. Like which one goes this way? Uh, I don't really know anywhere around here, so I don't know if that's weird for him to be there or not. Mm -hmm. Um describe the area. <laughs> uh there was a lot of. <laughs> <laughs> there, was, there, there were blasting music. <laughs> what type of music? Like, can um, you give me the beat? It was Kanye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, that place. <laughs> You, you see, in this world, Kanye existed. It's so far in the future, yet his music is still resonating with the youth. Unfortunately for our world, his name is Kanye South, and all the monsters hate him. <laughs> that's why That's why he's off to the north, man. That's why he's in the north ward. <laughs> but yeah, some, some, north, some sort of building, there were a couple of, a, a bunch of, uh, what's the name? It's... There were a bunch of other security bikes around there, but none of them were registered. Mm -hmm. And I don't think your partner was there. He wasn't there? Just a bunch of other, you know, I just the cops and, you know, some randos. That's, that's it. Doesn't make sense. I guess. <laughs> Does that then mean, like, if you didn't see, so you didn't see him, like, could he have been one of the cops? Could he have been one of the people, you know, that we've heard are taking up positions with the police and going around doing that? Probably. You know, if, again, if you're not registering your police officer, something is definitely going on. Uh, you, uh, see, boy, would he... you see Sana look over toward Riku for a second and then just go... Well, then I guess I'm coming with you. I guess she's coming with us. Because I told Riku that I would I would look into things with with him around, so I can't let you guys go to some weird cave place and lose Riku. Because if I don't, then oh, yeah. he's then he's right. gonna not he's gonna not help me find things, and then I'm gonna get kidnapped or something again. She just nods slowly, like, yeah, all right, understood. Do you have I mean, a replacement deck that you're using at the moment? Well, no, but why would I need a deck? We're going to a cave? <sighs> it is extremely dangerous, but for some reason, these magic beings operate with dual monsters cards anyway. Oh, that makes sense. It's very odd. No, it doesn't! <laughs> Listen, it's also extremely dangerous, and we don't know what could happen in whichever one we go into. Everything seems to have different rules from... Well, it's fine then. Just take me to a card shop. All right. Let's go find a card shop then. Oh, yeah, Those... like... <laughs> like, Thriller Killer would be like, all right, I'll go duel. Oh, wait, we actually... Oh yeah, um, let's go see yeah. Crystal, I guess. 
Well, we could go see her. <laughs> we have like, to. We don't, maybe we could just actually find a, another place. I mean, if you guys are no, if you guys are going if you guys are going into into the freaking underground anyway, you could just take her to a wicked phantom dealer. <laughs> oh yeah, that is also true. I wonder. Yeah. That makes me wonder if he can even make use of this fucking three pack thing I got. <laughs> I, I need to make a pit oh, stop yeah, before sure. I go. The where at? Need to grab some vials. I got to deal with phantom dealer. Uh, you're going. Uh, you're going back to the uh, the main area to go into the underground anyway. You should, mm-hmm. You'll be able to grab those when you get yeah. there. Yeah. And besides, I think we're gonna jump off the bikes and figure out how to get the the <laughs> the stripped bike down into the underground. I think that's what so, we want to do. So, um, we should probably get going because we're in this neighborhood with bikes just out of their lonesome. Oh, yeah, you guys me. brought the brakes. Hurry up, let's go. You just see oh, fucking. Kiwi. You just see fucking outside. There's just ki- there's just kiwis like surrounded by like ten dead bodies. He just sliced <laughs> through. Kiwis just vibing. <laughs> oh, no, we found the serial killer. <laughs> and then one of the victims are like, "But I asked for a duel." <laughs> And it's like, yeah, you got it. We dueled. <laughs> and I dueled you, and I won. <laughs> <laughs> you cut Good my job, cards. That was dueling. You cut my cards, and then my and then my life. <laughs> you cut my cards, and then my kneecaps. You literally cut my life points in half. My dual disc is broken. My body is no longer connected to my torso. Sucks to suck. Yep. Anyway, um, it's fine. Just play Monster Reborn. You guys eventually make your way over toward uh, over toward the bikes. Uh, upon doing so, in order to get everybody over in the area that you that you uh, that you guys want to go to, uh, you guys end up splitting up uh, between two <laughs> groups uh, because again, not five people can't fit on two bikes. Mm-hmm. So it's fine. I'll just jog. I was going to say. Um, <laughs> You see that immediately upon going out, uh, you see that Sano just goes straight to one of the dual discs and, like, gets in the front. <laughs> That's fine. That's what you can drive. But she, <laughs> she's fine. It, is, it, is her, it is her. It is her fucking uh, pastime this time. Um, <laughs> and Riku wants to drive the other one. Cool. I thought mean... you said you were jogging, Riku. Uh, I... I did also call dibs, I just remembered. <laughs> he did call dibs. On one hand, I did call dibs. <laughs> I mean that I mean, one I mean one of them's gonna be gonna be uh driven by an AI is all I'm saying. <laughs> Which one's the AI one, by the way? Whichever one. We'll say it's this one. I wanna scare her. I mean It probably is also better if we're trying to find the area. Yeah. Yeah, I can drive that another time. It's fine. <laughs> Just, Thank you, Riku, whoever, former you're, whoever's color going, editor. Whoever's going on things, get on things. <laughs> All right. Come on, Sana. Let's go find them then, bike. Hey. Only if there was someone selling a bike which I could purchase. If only. If only. <laughs> if only. If only. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, you need, I'm sorry, Riku. You can't buy it. You need uh, uh, 31,450 dual points to get that bike. <laughs> I just get nothing. It's a bike. Listen, most of this money is going to go to the fucking fan pack if we ever find it. I'll, I'll give a good 10k to it, maybe more. Who knows? As you guys would make your way, would make your way there. Uh, you guys would tell Kiwi where you're going, and he'd be like, "I ain't fucking going there." That's fine. You take care, King. <laughs> I'm fucking sorry you're about. Going nowhere. Sorry about earlier, Kiwi. I. I didn't mean to. I just wanted to get to know you. I didn't mean anything by it. I don't know why you're apologizing. Nothing happened. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> People keep saying that nothing <laughs> happened. There's no rat. <laughs> <laughs> the rat is in okay. the There's no rat in Boston, say. <laughs> It doesn't look like Kiwi is is very is very keen to want to talk about anything. That's fine. This is just this is chillin'. But uh, he does he does sort of nod to you, Prisca, afterwards, just like. Mm. 
you guys would make your way back. Uh, four of you quicker than Riku, who would be who would be just basically jogging. <laughs> He's like, fuck, 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 damn it. I want a bike. <laughs> I hate this. I fucking hate I need a this. bike. <laughs> By the time Riku would get there, uh, Prisca, you would have gotten your uh, you would have gotten your vials uh, that you would need, as well as the finished drinks. Uh, I'm guessing from your from the from your your experimentations. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, you would get those things. Uh, you would let Street know that you know, hey, Street, whenever you work <laughs> out, like dunk your clothes inside of a pot. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And she's also going to notice Riku panting. And they go, okay, I'll I'll jog this time. Well, you guys aren't going on bikes anymore. <laughs> you don't need to jog. We don't need don't to worry, go here comes now. Riku. Hey, hey, Street, can I borrow <laughs> your can I borrow your dual disc? Mine broke. You wanna? Why do you? Uh, yeah, you're going and doing something weird again. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, I doubt you want to come with us after I'll, everything that happened last time. If you don't mind, I'll sit this one out. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, my, I dropped my dual disc down a hole and it's broken. Thank you. Uh, leave it here. Maybe we can take it over to Mars or something. Mm. With that, uh, he will then. It says with that he will probably transfer over 10k as like an initial covering cost for trying to repair this thing hey, to him. Go. It's like yeah, I don't know how much it'll be. Here's 10k. Uh, okay, I'll see what I can do. Thank you very much. If he will grab this, and now, hey, now he has a dedicated dual disc. You have a dedicated Bam. disc. The dedicated Bam. disc is is pretty is pretty neato. It has two regulator slots, and it gives plus Bam. one AC. Or the hybrid is... disc it gave plus two AC, so your AC is gonna go down by one. Oh. Oop. But Man, you can I have two sure regulator wish... slots. I sure wish scrap iron worked. What a... <laughs> I done that shit was broken. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but uh as you as you get there, um, uh you guys basically um, uh you guys basically get everything you need ready. Uh and they're not ready to di to ditch the bike yet. <laughs> they're not entirely ready oh, to completely right. junk the bike over yet. What's up? All right. You guys make sure to hide the bikes just in case the cops come around again. Yeah. 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 <laughs> It looks over toward the fucking, the fucking, uh, junked out freaking sector security bike. We'll take them oh, down. Um, we'll take them down into, you, into the subway. If you want something funny for the sector security bike, leave it at one of the crawler bases. We'll figure out what to do. Just a suggestion. A lot of us don't really want to go back to the crawler bases. You know what, fair. <laughs> we'll see what we can do. We'll put the three of them down into the into the subway area. You guys again with uh with Sano in in tow because they're just like, you know, they they, they want to, they want to make sure to uh to be able to go and do the things they want to do. So it's like, I guess we'll do your things first, whatever. I need cards, fine. I'm great at cards. <laughs> This I poor thing. I'm, I'm a pro. <laughs> this poor thing has no idea what she's gotten herself into. You guys would this... make your way down into the subway area, or down into the underground of, of the satellite. Upon going far enough, you guys find very easily the area to turn into uh, the, um, uh, the um, uh, place where you usually leave Scrappa and the others. As you turn in there, you find again an entire area full of scrap that seems to be piled up from uh from up high all around this place. When stepping in, you do notice that there is a very big lack of birds in here, unfortunately. <laughs> um, but uh, well, they they you you've been told kind of what's going on there. You find the wicked phantom dealer off to one side. You find the um uh the. Um, uh, the Dark Charmer off to one other side, and again you find Scrappa near the center, uh, getting his getting his big his big boy his big scrapyard gardener boy to collect things and throw them down into the thing in order to make his fucking dragon. Um, you actually notice that while this is here, 
uh, uh, that uh, he, there is uh, there is quite a quite a, no, a lo, quite a lot more just random ass like like uh, like uh, bots and other things that kind of look like uh, Scrapyard Gardener off to the side, as if he had, as if there was other failed experiments that he's that's been going on in the days you've left him here. But uh, one other thing you'll notice, uh, aside from all of those sort of uh, scrapped out uh, fail failed attempts at creating a dragon. There is one other person moving around there. Another person? There is. Whom could it be? You find probably the one that uh that is that is here to to speak with you, the one that came from from the uh from the underground. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh you boy. You find a man that uh has a a very intimidating uh visage to him. Uh, especially in the fact that he is carrying several several large firearms on him. Oh, cool. oh boy! <laughs> Love me a man who's well prepared, I guess. Hey, Ricky, get a gun. Yeah, you go. There you go. Just ask. I would like a gun, please. As you sir. find this man, Tristan. <laughs> <laughs> you find. This man standing there holding on to holding on to all of his uh, all of his large amounts of wares and guns. Okay, hello, Terminator. <laughs> <laughs> Tristan Terminator, man. Like what? Yeah, dude, the fucking A forces are here. As you as you turn uh, to go to him, uh, he does he does like see all of you enter, uh, and before Wicked Phantom Dealer can make his way over. He starts slum, uh, stepping forward. You guys hear almost like some semi-robotic sounds as he's moving forward. As you notice that there are parts of him that have been completely replaced with mechanics. Uh, as we can find out, nope, never fucking mind then. Um, <laughs> no one gonna know why. As this large man makes his way toward all of you, are you the ones that are gonna be making your way down into the depths? Um. Yes. I've been waiting here for you for the better part of several hours now. I come asking for I come asking for a request. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. What do you what is your request? Is it to kill someone? If it comes to that. My name is the Cyber Commander. I would like you to well Aid the resistance that is inside the underground. We are currently having a problem. Food shortages all over, as well as many different people that would not, that never come back from the depths. I've heard that you have made your way through the netherworld and back. I think that with your power, you can help us obtain our freedom. Mm. Uh you know what? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thank you. That's what I like to hear. Thrill seeker. Make sure you don't commit to any do anything you won't commit to, Riku. Uh, three, <laughs> three hours later. Listen, I'm gonna commit to this man. Have you it's a terminate, it's a cyber command. You're like looking at his abs, Riku, huh? You're like looking like at looking his juicy at his abs. <laughs> His guns and his guns. <laughs> and his gun. Hmm. <laughs> his guns. No as, wonder Nyan Nyan couldn't get Riku. As you guys say say yes to the cyber commander, you see that him uh, you see him bring his uh, bring his gun up to the side. He gives you he gives you all just like a look down, give um, uh, like um, uh, bows downward. Thank you for your help. And I think that with you guys one uh, agreeing to help the cyber commander very easily i think uh we're gonna be ending things off there for the there for the night what we're ending like practically on time yeah dude. Why not? whoa <laughs> yeah we did it we did it oh, oh wait what's that silhouette dun dun <laughs> dun dun Dana, it's dana, dana, dana. Ed with a gun <laughs> Bro. i'm just saying what reason did we have not to help him that's true. Solid point. 
he's oh, like yeah, the, he's no. like the 90s combined into one character dude cyber <laughs> commander is ready to fuck dude <laughs> Cyber Commander what? with what? custom art. Like, I need help for my people. It's like, you need help? <laughs> <laughs> was he ever made into an actual card? I don't know. Yeah, he was, it was it was an actual card. Yeah. It didn't look like this. This is this is uh this is Lindo <clears throat> art for, oh, for Cyber oh, yeah. Commander. Um but uh I did the same thing for Magician of Faith as well. I made I made the Magician of Faith look kind of like Taya. <laughs> Well, I guess Lindo did, but uh, you know, I told him to. I, I don't know. <laughs> this guy looks more like a Honda to me. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, he's he's, he's, he's the actual he's the actual <laughs> Cyber Commander, but he's but he's Tristan. <laughs> I, I was not ready. I was there. not ready. <laughs> Bro, what the fuck? I will say, I, unlike I, I will gonna... say, unlike the Magician of Faith, I have actually made a lot of changes to the Cyber Commander card because also, it was I'm it was just... a terrible card for some reason. <laughs> I also, I noticed a lot of endurance you did, so I'm just gonna. I do appreciate you didn't do the voice. I'm thank you, <laughs> dude. I wouldn't. I'm not gonna go. For, I'm not gonna make him make him a freaking uh, make him make him a joke. What are you talking about? <laughs> it would never thank be you. a joke. <laughs> Dude, Tristan is a fucking man. All right, go watch. Yeah. Go back and watch original Yu-Gi-Oh. He he's like one of the first people that's like, nah, I'm gonna fucking immediately try the thing. Everybody, everybody in the everybody in the audience is screaming to do. I'm gonna try to suplex this man. <laughs> oh, yeah. And I I have to say the anime did him a lot more justice than the manga. <laughs> like I, I'm putting point to anime there. They he actually was cared about it. He was honestly like, like um, uh, again, um, Squeaky in particular when we were playing Opera Rock was like, can, can I, can't I, can I just go attack them? Can I just punch them? And Tristan Taylor is one of the main reasons against something like that because we all see how well that works in actual Yu Gi Oh. <laughs> unfortunately, <laughs> it does work sometimes, so that's good. But <laughs> it does work you sometimes. Have I, you story. have to enjoy yeah. Tristan. You have to enjoy yeah, Honda. Yeah. It did work at one time, like Jonochi was able to do it before the card game existed. Yeah, but then like, things he, changed. There was... <laughs> if you ever want to see a good Jonochi one, the fucking yo-yo episode's one of the fucking best. <laughs> <laughs> do, do, do. I miss them when they were able to be aggressive motherfuckers. <laughs> But yeah, in case people in case people can't remember uh the magician of faith image. I'm going to I'm going to grab that really quick. I'm going to grab that card just to, just kind of just kind of show it. Do, 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 do. We'll move we'll move <laughs> it over here to to the legend card really quick. Just 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 really quick. Ba, 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 ba. In case people can't remember the changes the magician of faith card had on them. Do, do, do. Bring out the magician of faith. She's here. It was it was made after the uh, it was made after the the image where Magician of Faith was using their their big old their big old thingy and in the uh, in the episode is really good and when we made her and we made her look more like Taya. <laughs> yeah. And it's the same with Cyber Commander. He just looks like he just looks like the Tristan boy. <laughs> Again, he's like, I need help. You you sure? You, you whatever's sure, my down, whatever's down there if you can't handle it we can't you know if i shut up i've heard that you went as far as the netherworld and back <laughs> i feel like i feel like you're you're ready for the task i mean sure we have the girls of mr magoo but you don't rely on mr magoo <laughs> <laughs> dude uh, we I'm walked glad. into the netherworld tried to make an army we lost the entire army and then got in there anyway <laughs> And the I'm, little we did save decided to yeet. <laughs> I'm glad he wasn't like, I heard you killed the Neverrealm King. <laughs> and it's like, well, you did it. You did it, Riku. You saved the city. When we're getting Flame Swordsman Joey and Dark Magician Yugi, we probably won't, unfortunately. I, I really mm. liked doing it for these two in particular. But, like, it, uh, at least when you look at Flame Swordsman and Dark Magician, they are usable cards in their own right. Like, Magician mm -hmm. of Faith is obviously usable, too. But, like, I really, I, I mostly wanted to do it for Cyber Commander, just because Cyber Commander got no fucking love. Yeah, but now he's a... Kind of. Now he's a uh, now he's a really, a really good uh, member of his archetype. If I, if I no, would... Now he fucks. Listen. 
if people wanted me to, I could show the Cyber Commander card. Yeah, sure. If people wanted me to, I could show the Cyber Commander card. Come on, yeah, we're people. not people. I'm <laughs> we're not people. What do you think this is? I'm people. <laughs> I'm just saying, like, if people, if, if, if people wanted me to. I'm not sure if people do, though. <laughs> not entirely sure how well people want me to show the cyber command. Hey, hey, Deka, what are the odds that we're actually going to find the person with the fan pack next time? <laughs> Who knows, man? Who fucking Who knows? knows? <laughs> I like to think it's also cyber commander. He's like, by the way, I've been selling these sick bags for a couple <laughs> 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 for a couple of days now. On an unrelated note, the resistance has gathered these packs. A fan <laughs> pack, if you will. A fan <laughs> pack, if you will. The Freedom mm. Army pack. Yeah. Freedom Army yeah. provisions. Dude, I'm trying to actually find the emergency uh, provisions. I'm actually, I'm trying to actually find the the the, the set that I put them in. <laughs> But uh, it's it's he's, he's, where where he at where where he go? <laughs> oh, there he is! I found him. Do, 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 do. Here is the Cyber Commander card in all of his glory. Yes. 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 What? Where is it? He's a tuner. <laughs> he is a tuner. <laughs> where is it? It's over by there where. Is... Uh... Yes. <laughs> Look at that man. So he's better now. He's and much he's a better now. Ooh. Yeah. He is a he's, he's a, a cyber card. Throws monsters in the grave. You can uh, have one stacked them. Uh, one card stacked under another card from the field to your hand. <laughs> oh, it's a stacker. You oh, and no. your stacking. <laughs> he's also considered a gate and a cipher card. So he's from the cyber archetype, the gate archetype, and the cipher archetype. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you and your multi-typing. <laughs> so, you, so you were saying earlier about how this guy's trust in the Legend of Faith is Taya. It's fine. We don't need Yugi and Joey. We can just get Decode Talker with, with Playmaker. <laughs> yeah, there we go. We'll grab. We'll grab more. We'll grab like more, more, uh, more side characters that hardly duel and throw them in cards. <laughs> Like the one I was surprised. Yugi can be part of it, but he has to be mushroom. And yeah, it's like well, you—it's like you guys are like looking at this, like why? Why can't you do it? And then you guys look at his look at his attack power. Um, uh, <laughs> like, guys, we don't need a Yugi and Joey one. They exist. It's called the Yujo friendship or whatever. <laughs> it's true. Yeah, you your friendship. <laughs> in fact, the Tem we... has his own card. Yeah, he do. Who knows? Maybe we can get Miho some art. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there we go. That I'd actually, go. I'd be into. I'd actually be into. <laughs> I'd actually be into getting to getting Miho um, uh, a card. That'd be Miho? something I'd be into. I mean, she did wear a mermaid outfit, so she you couldn't you, make her an Amazon. You know what was weird something. to me? Here's something that I did not think was true. Like before reading the manga, I thought Miho was from the series, and Duke Devlin was the filler. <laughs> Other way around. <laughs> 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 yeah, Duke Devlin does a lot less in the manga, but his dad was a in the manga. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Bandit Keith was just dead. Pegasus just killed him. <laughs> Only in America. Only in America. In America. I want a Devlin yeah, card, yeah, dude. I'm... Duke Devlin card, Serenity card, maybe. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, I I, oh, I just I just really wanted to get Cyber Commander like like an actual good card and like making him yeah. a tuner just seemed very cool. Like uh, adding in the cybers, um, uh, like like stuff is is pretty cool. Um, mm -hmm. Machine support we haven't got a lot of machine support in in our game so far. We're gonna see a lot more pretty soon. Um, uh, the machine the, working with the gate cards because they're really good for for uh for turbo duels. Working with ciphers because who knows maybe that's maybe that's gonna be something. Who's to say? Um. But uh, he's, he's a pretty good boy. Look at that boy. Pretty good boy. Hello, boy. <laughs> Hello, boy. You know, when you Hello, say gate boy. cards, like... When you Hello, say gate boy, cards, I welcome. immediately think of Bakugan. <laughs> <laughs> he is here. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. We'll see how, how that affects everything uh, in the future. 
Uh, da, da, da. With all that being said, I'm going to check something out very quickly. Uh, da, da. One day I can show that Riku thing. <laughs> Anyone else think it's messed up that in the canon of Yu-Gi-Oh, Yu-Gi's like, I'm going to make my own game. Like, that's the worst thing you could do to him post GX 5D's sex soul. Like, I mean, to be fair, GX is back to number one king of games, so I'm pretty sure he gave up on that dream. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's the worst thing to do to him. Like, I'm gonna make a game, and Kaiba's like, I have a lot more money than you. Duel Monsters is gonna rule the damn world. Oh, you and your hyperbole. Oh, <laughs> Why are you such a I'm hyper okay. bully? <laughs> oh, ho, ho. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Yeah. And then it turns out Kaibu was right, and then Yugo was like, fuck it, I'll be king of games again. And then GX. <laughs> you did not beat me with a marshmallow, Yugi! <laughs> I fucking did. <laughs> no! <clears throat> doop doop. Chicken. Blah. That's weird. What's weird? What's weird? I'm looking for something very quickly. Da -da -da -da. Mm. Trying to see if uh, I can find a a a a, a certain a certain poison. Oh, a poison. A poison. Is it me? It's it's definitely you. One hundred percent you. It's time right for here. you. I'm glad you figured it out. Do -do -do. Good job, Will. You did it. Yeah. I thought it's so happy. Actually, it can't be even. I can't be mean anymore. <laughs> I oh, tried to make okay. it sound defeated too. <laughs> uh, one day we'll do recycling. <laughs> interesting. Interesting. Okay. So I was gonna. I was gonna do. I was gonna do a thing, but apparently. But apparently they are. Uh, they are at a. They are at a. Se uh, they are at a separate uh, area. So I can. I, I can send over there. But that's. That's hardly gonna be. Be a. Be a freaking dent and things i'm gonna we're gonna send you guys off on a raid mm -hmm. and uh we're gonna raid uh we're gonna we're gonna raid sayu uh the, for those of you who don't yeah. for those of you who don't know some uh, which is crazy if you don't sayu is a is a vtuber uh who's doing who's doing some some pretty pretty cute stuff right now however uh over on sayu's side uh there is also a um, uh, there's also a another uh vtuber being introduced with their model uh, their name is Scylla, and they're really they're really sweet. They're a little fairy. So we're gonna send you guys over <laughs> over to them so that you can you can uh, hang out and you can hang out and be like, oh, what's going on? What's going down? And I think they're playing some Battleship right now. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Ooh, Battleship. Battleship it's is Scylla's, pretty neat. Um, soft debut. Yeah. yeah oh, that's, why, that's why I was. Ship. That's why I was King like. Me. That's why I was like, it's weird that that like they're they're not on their own. Uh, they're on their own thing, but but that's that's. that's I, fine. I guess that's why it's the soft debut, and not the full one. Yeah, probably yeah. something like that. Either way, we're gonna that send is... you guys over. Uh, sit, watch and watch them play some Battleship. Uh, later on today, we're gonna be playing some uh, Final Fantasy over on Jake's channel, and uh, tomorrow we're gonna be doing some. We're gonna be doing some heckin' uh, some heckin' uh, Zeldas. Maybe you heard of it. Mm. Uh, mm -hmm. And uh, Wednesday, hopefully, we're coming back to Avatar. We're gonna hope to try to get everything settled once again for this week. The last thing that I want to mention is that this Friday, a certain game is coming out, uh, and uh, I may or may not be planning to attempt another twenty-four hour stream. <laughs> and then we never saw him again, in case you were wondering. <laughs> so yeah, then he disappeared. Friday morning, uh, we're gonna be trying our best to uh, to do a twenty-four hour, and that's gonna be pretty fun. Uh, so be ha be sure to be a part of the Discord so you know when that's gonna happen. With all that being said, my dudes. Any questions? Until next time, guys. Like always. Later days. Good Say hi to Scylla. Bye bye. Yeah, goodbye. So was Sal just in Riku's room? <laughs>